Hello? Uh, hello? Oh god. Uh, uh, wait, is it time for the stream to start? Oh no, uh, okay, um, ah uh, shoot. I kinda ran out of time. Uh, what, one second. Hold on. I gotta, one second guys. I'll, I'll be there in a second. One second everybody. Just gotta, just, I just need a, one sec, let me wash my hands. Let me just, uh, what, just, just a second everybody. Okay. Okay, I'm drying off my hands. And... Hi! Hey everybody, I made it! I'm not late. I'm not late to my first stream. We made it. What's up, gamers? Whew. We, uh, we got it. We, <laughs> we're just in time. N not even close. Not even close. How's it going, everybody? Oh my god! <laughs> it's so good to see all of you! Happy first stream! Welcome to the stream! Oh my god, there's so many of you. Chat's moving so fast, nobody can tell I'm a gamer. Oh! You guys are putting dog emojis in the chat. You must have noticed. Yeah, <laughs> you know, nothing special. Just a, you know, just a super cool dog. Just a super cool dog hanging out. <laughs> on my bed there <laughs> you know I don't like to brag but you know we gotta we got a dog you guys want to meet the dog you guys want to meet the dog hey hey how's it going boy how's it going oh Dizio, thank you for becoming a mega chat. Oh my god. And Soul Bad Greg? Soul Bad Greg, thanks for Soul the Bad super Greg chat. Super chatted $20. Happy first stream, Power Guy. We've got text to speech. That's crazy. I think my dog heard it. <laughs> so, yeah, this is my dog. His name is Murph. He's a very good boy. Murph, come here. Come here, boy. Come here. Come here. No, don't look at them. Come on. Jump 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 into my arms. Come on. Let me get a little closer. Come on. Come on, baby boy. Come on. Jump into my arms. Yeah! We got a dog! Oh my god! We got a freaking Look at him! Look into, <laughs> look into his eyes! Oh, let me bring him really close. Look at him! The Murph! You get dog! <laughs> oh my god! He's a little baby! He's my baby, and I am his father now. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, thank you for the super chat. Ah! Illica's Rage is super chatted $5. Fantastic entrance there. Lamal. I don't do emoji, sorry. Thank you so much for the super chat, Illica's Rage. Oh! Thedrick Binks is now a mega chad? <laughs> thank you so much, guys. Holy cow. So let me tell you guys what happened. Let me do a little explaining. I know a lot of you guys saw the video this morning. For context, about two weeks ago, after I beat Mega Man 6, I was under the impression that I'd be getting a new body, and that the doc would be making me a new body. But he, uh, you know, that's not how it happened. And uh, afterwards, I was, you know, just hanging out, kind of depressed, understandably so. And uh, suddenly, Nat super chatted ten dollars. Happy first stream, power guy. Love Murph. <laughs> Thank you so much, Nat. Thank you for the super chat. Oh. 
<laughs> welcome to the Mega Chads, Yuto Yamazaki. Welcome, welcome. So yeah, when when Murph appeared, he Neo came Nuts with super chatted two dollars and nineteen cents. Hey, I'm third ever donator. Also, <gasps> hi, I love dog. Third ever donator. Hello. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Just Alex. Oh my goodness. Just Alex super chatted $5. Bro only appeared for like about 5 to 6 months and he already have 10k. Congrats. <laughs> Thank you so much. So yeah, uh, two weeks ago this happened and suddenly I have a dog. He, he came out of nowhere. He's gay statue super chatted $10. Power guy, you cutie. You deserved a dog. Oh, I'm not that cute. Thank you. Thank you, gay statue. Appreciate it. So yeah, uh, he didn't come alone. He he had a note attached to him, and this is the note. I'm gonna put it on screen. Hold up to the. Hold up to the gosh darn screen. Murph, spelled M-E-R-F. Uh. Please take care of him. He has anxiety. Oh, poor guy. I promise Orbit I'll save him. Super chatted four dollars and ninety nine cents. So, are you a Tamagotchi? You must be because why else would a computer <laughs> program need to use the bathroom? I'm not a Tamagotchi. I'm. I mean, that's actually kind of a good take. Uh, I guess I kind of am. No, I'm not a Tamagotchi. I'm. Uh, we'll get into that later. I've got a whole, got a whole PowerPoint presentation explaining what I am, and how I am, and why I am. <laughs> Yo, Kirito Kiragaya, welcome to the Mega Chads. You absolute Chad, you. Thanks for joining, man. The support means a lot. So yeah, he came with this note. Apparently, he has anxiety. I don't know what the second line means. I promise I'll save him. Maybe he's a rescue? I don't know. Probably, probably just, yeah, you're a rescue. Are you adopted? Are you a little adopted baby boy? Are you, am I not your real dad, but I'm your new dad? Guys, don't tell him he's adopted. Sam Johansson super chatted fifteen dollars. Do you enjoy Power Desu? Sam Johansson with the fifteen. Do I enjoy Power? They don't call me Power Guy for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <Robbie> super chatted five dollars. Power Guy, I love your content. Yeah, I'm a bit of a power enjoyer. How could you tell? Blobby with the five. Thank you so much, man. And Mizuchi, welcome to the Mega Chads, dude. Thank you so much. Thank you everybody that's that's coming in to the stream. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Bro, is the dog a Battle Network reference? Uh, is there a, is, is there a, does Mega Man have a dog in Battle Network? I honestly don't know. I know there's Rush.exe and he kind of looks like a... I... No, he's not a Battle Network reference. He's just a dog. Look at him. Kyuto. Kyuto doggy. So yeah. Thank you guys for coming to the stream. Let me kind of go through how this is going to go. What are we doing for our first stream? Lots of people are asking, hey, what are you, what are you gonna do for your first stream? What are you gonna play? And we'll get to that. So how it's gonna go, I've got a... Okay, so <laughs> imagine you're back in school for a moment or your your school's in session and it's PowerPoint presentation day. I've got a PowerPoint presentation to sort of introduce myself to you guys. And, uh, and, and once we get through that, afterward, you know, there, there's going to be some games, 
viewer participation PowerPoint games, like any good PowerPoint presentation. Uh, afterward, we're gonna play the Mega Man games, starting with, uh, uh, well, the, the Mega Man Game Boy games, starting with, you know, the first one. I'm gonna see how many we can do today. I think we'll probably finish all of them this weekend. And we'll also do a Q&A. And, uh, yeah. But first, let's hop into this PowerPoint Dalton presentation I worked so hard on. $3.37. Yo, here's my whole <laughs> Google Play Yo! balance. Yo! Thank you for the Google Play balance. Oh my god. $3.37? Yeah, it's, it's one off of Leet. What kind of coincidence is that? Anyway, let's hop in. Let's do some poor point. Give me one second to set it up and everything. And, uh... Uh... Slideshow. Okay. Oh! You know, it's been a while since I had to make a PowerPoint. I haven't been in school for years! But here we are. Oh! Ramen Sake Super Chatted $50, High Power Guy Traman. I hope you're having an awesome stream. Thank you so much, Ramen. Is that Ramen Bits? Is that my good friend Ramen Bits? Oh man, $50 Super Chat. Thank you so much. Wow. Thank you guys so much for the support. <laughs> We got a PowerPoint going on here. Oh. Entropic Dismay with the $2 super chat. How do I become a member? If you want to join the mega chats, Entropic Dismay super just scroll down, $1 click the join cents. button. How do I become we only a have, uh, we've got one tier right now. For $5, you get a couple of perks. You get some emotes you can use in the chat. And, uh, yeah. That's, that's, that's how you join. Thank you. Thank you for, thank you for the super chat. Okay. So I introduce you all to the Power Guy Pretty Potter's PowerPoint presentation. It is a presentation all about Power Guy and why, in my opinion, he's pit p p Pretty Poggers. Uh, you know. I think I'm pretty poggers. Self-love is important. I think everybody should think they're pretty poggers. I think you guys are pretty poggers. <laughs> Just Alex super chatted $2. Guys, no super chat during study time. Yeah, guys, it's study time. No more super chats. Just kidding. You can super chat all you want. <laughs> Nicholas Yarembinski super chatted $4.99. What's your favorite Mega Man game? Also, what made you want to make Mega Man games? Also, you're amazing and deserve all the support you tee. Thank you, Nicholas. Um, my favorite Mega Man game. Apin super chatted $4.99. Been really enjoying your Mega Man videos, man. Can't wait till you get to the Zero series, that will be something. Thank you, Apin. Uh, Nicholas, thank you so much for the super chat. Uh, my favorite game in the entire series is Mega Man X4. It's just a huge part of my childhood, and that's also kind of why I wanted to make videos on the games, because it's the series that's impacted my life the most. And I thought, wow, well, let's... Let's, let's do that. That's a good place to start. Good place as any, at least. Thank you guys so much for the super chats. So yeah, um, this is my Pretty Poggers PowerPoint presentation. Uh, okay, I, I lied off the bat. This actually isn't a PowerPoint presentation. Uh, I'm sorry. We, we have to, we have to change the name or I might get into legal trouble so uh this is actually a google slides so technically it's the power guy giga god gamer google slides extravaganza 
So that's what we're calling it from now on. The hype train before we, before we continue, let's make I sure we get the name right. Man again. Yeah, I'm sorry, I lied to you. I, I trolled you. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, the hype trains. Yeah, a man with good taste. The hype trains, you gotta see the, the train, the train robot master. Every time you super chat, you get to see the train. So whenever you feel like looking at lots and lots of trains, you know what to do. Okay, let's let's continue on with the Giga God Gamer Google Slides extravaganza. So the question on everyone's mind who he is? Who even is Power Guy? Who am I? Well, I'm glad you asked. Hypothetically speaking. I mean, technically. Oh. Tony! <laughs> Welcome to the Mega Chads. Thanks for joining, man. I really appreciate the support. Wacky Snacky Super Shatted $9.99. Uh, pogging. For real. Yippee. I'm pogging for real, for real. Thank you so much. So, my name is Guy. Power Guy. My first name is Guy. My last name is Power, technically speaking. That's what it says on my driver's license. Or what it would say on my driver's license if I had a driver's license. On my fake driver's license, it says Guy Power. Um... But you can call me Guy, you can call me Power, you can call me any variation of the things, you know, whatever, whatever you like, honestly. You can call me just anything, I, I don't, whatever makes you happy, makes me happy. Uh, there is one uh, caveat though, one time the doc, he called me, he called me P-Guy? Okay. Listen, if you're a pee guy, that's that's totally fine. Totally acceptable. I got nothing wrong with pee guys. But I am not a pee guy. I'm 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 a guy and my last name starts with a P, but I am not a pee guy. You know, if if you're a pee guy and that floats your boat, you you can be a pee guy all you want. It's fine. Okay? But I'm not a pee guy. It's just not my cup of pee. Cup of tea. Damn it. Okay. Um Let's move on. Species. Now, I know I look like a human. Illica's with... Rage is super chatted five dollars. Guy power. Long nice one. Thank you so much, Illica's Rager. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I know I look like a human, but I got kinda like these jagged edges on me and stuff. Like a pixelated human. Well, to put it simply. I am a game. I am a video game character. I'm trapped inside a video game. I was, oh. oh my God. There's so many, there's so much financial support. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Sam Johansson super chatted $20. Thank you for the super Nanny. chat. Fade Highwind, welcome to the mega chats. Sam Johansson with the nay nay. Tatcha super chatted five dollars. Thank you Orange so much. Powerhouse, Net Navi, the Mega Man tuber. <laughs> UD.exe, Orange Powerhouse, Net Navi, the Mega Man tuber. Yeah, about that. A lot of people are like, "Hey, are you a Net Navi?" No, I'm not. I'm technically not a Net Navi. My specs are way too low. All right. Be super cool if I was a net navy. If I was a net navy, I could, you know, could jack in to any outlet and just run around wherever I want on the internet. I could go into your smart fridge and, you know, <laughs> turn turn the degrees all the way up so you know all your milk goes bad and stuff. I could I could hack your your Tesla. I could I could steal your credit card you know being a net navi would be rad but i'm not a net navi unfortunately i'm just a guy stuck in a video game a really old video game 
and uh, so it's kind of hard to explain. I guess you could call me an AI. I'm kind of like an AI, but with extra steps. Someone earlier said, hey, are you a Tamagotchi? Well, yeah, kind of. I'm like an AI, but I have to, I have to eat, I have to drink, I have to sleep, I have to cry sometimes to make sure the rest of my emotions are working. And, uh, yeah, uh, DZib with the $2 super chat, I'ma call you Steve. That's fine, I love Minecraft. You can call me, Zip super call chat me is Steve. $2. I am MMA call you Steve. <laughs> so, um, to give you guys another kind of quick lore rundown, basically, uh, this is my computer. It's a Macintosh 128K. The game I am in was pre installed on it, and that computer was discovered earlier this year. The year of our Lord 20XX, but the X stands for. Two, and I was activated on August 1st. That was when I posted my first video. Um, the scientist that discovered me, Doc, he gets funding from whatever department he's a part of every time I beat a game. So he's gonna he he promises he's gonna use that funding Orbit to make me a real body. Chatted one dollar and ninety nine cents. I hope you don't think those are real tears. <laughs> they are real tears. Just because they're square doesn't mean they're not real. Okay? <laughs> My tears! My tears are real! Can we get much higher? I can't sing anymore, I'll get DMCA'd. Um, See so yeah, the doc is gonna make me a new body, he promises. Uh, I just gotta believe him for now, and I, it might take me beating every game ever made until we get there. But um, I'm sure it's fine. We'll we'll get there. I mean, there's only there's not that many games, right? There's there's, there's only a couple hundred thousand, you know, only a. I think Google says like 800,000. Illica's rage That's not too bad. $2. August 1st <laughs> is my birthday too. Yay birthday brothers. <laughs> Thank you so much Illica's rage. Super chatted $5. Happy birthday, you're happy a birthday. But you're customizable. Birthday so buddies. You're a bit. Ah. Did you just call me a Neopet? Total velocity on a super chatted $1.99. The fact Murph got in implies there's a way out. Hey, that's a good point. The fact Murph Dr. got in catfish implies there's a way out. Maybe. Say hi to Volt Catfish for me when you get to X3. I will, Dr. Catfish. Thank you. I'll the post super chatted $1.99. If you are a Macintosh 128K, why is there color? That's a really good question. So... I am in a Macintosh 128K. Here, let me show you. Let me... Kind of fit really snugly, actually. This is nice. So I am in a Macintosh 128K, but the dock installed a bunch of different peripherals and stuff that uh, allow it to function, you know, on a, on a better level. Like, there's this, I don't know, I, I think this is a power supply here. I don't know, I haven't looked at like the diagrams or anything, but there's lots of peripheral hardware that allows me to, you know, stream for one thing. You couldn't stream on a Macintosh 128K. You could try. I don't think you could Use do it. Sniper super Someone prove me wrong. Dollars. I love your vids. Any Macintosh you totally enjoyers to out there? At some point. The game is very Mega Man like and has a banger soundtrack. Journey to Silius? I've never heard of that actually. But I'm always down to play any Mega Man like games. So uh yeah, I'll I'll write that down and I'll check it out. Journey to Silius. Cool. Thank you for the suggestion. But yeah, so the Mac 128K baseline does not have, you know, 32 pit color or anything like that. It would not be able to render me normally. 
So what I'm told is the scientists, they found my computer. They found a game on it with me in it. And they were like, huh, there's no way this game could possibly even run. Whoever made it was an idiot. Kind of a smart idiot. And so they connected a bunch of weird shit to my computer. So I'm like a little computer being <laughs> being carried by a bunch of other computers, but I'm still trapped. So, uh, yeah. And that's not where the weirdness ends. Uh, moving on to my age. I was born four months ago, but if you were to ask me how old I am, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm at least 20. My creation date was August 1st, 20XX, but I have these memories of before that, okay? So my actual birthday is August or October 8th, sometime in the 90s or something. I don't know. I don't freaking know. So yeah, I've I I've only been alive for four months. I get that. I understand. I accept that. But I also have memories before that, which is weird. I'm not sure. I'm sure we'll figure that out at some point. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Not legal. Four months old. Well, thank goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness no one's trying to have sex with me, right? You know, <laughs> and that's not changing for a long time. When you get to the X series, make sure to slap Sigma's. Oh, he's read for me. Why am I reading three dollars and sixty-seven cents. Read it when for you me, get TTS. to the X series, make sure to slap Sigma's bald head for me. Yeah, I'm gonna slap him. Bald bastard. I'm gonna slap him in every game. He's all. He always comes back. No matter how bald he gets, <laughs> his baldness gives him strength to return. So, uh, you're a Gemini. Uh, I don't know. Gay statue super shatty two dollars. You are a really Gemini. Gotten into, never really gotten into that kind of thing, uh, astrology. He's a Gemini man. Oh. <laughs> Why do you use a 38 year old computer? I don't have a choice. <laughs> this is where I am. Zip super chatted two dollars. So you're possibly an uploaded consciousness. Am I possibly an uploaded consciousness? Okay, we're getting existential here. I don't know. I don't know what I am. I don't know who I am. We don't need to talk about it. Okay. What am I? <laughs> it like zooms in on my face really close and I do the the crazy anime face. What am I? <laughs> so uh yeah, let's move on. The the other how, in case you guys are wondering, how tall am I? Lots of people like to know how tall their friends are. Well, it's hard to say. Usually, I am 180 pixels tall from the crown of my head, not counting the little spiky bits of my hair back there, to the soles of my feet, 180 pixels tall. But sometimes it's a little weird. When you zoom out far enough and I enter my overworld sort of mode, I'm only 30 pixels tall. Okay. So, it's very inconsistent. However! Gay statue super chatted two dollars. You are a Libra. A Libra good guy, ya. Yeah. A Libra? Am I? Pog. I hope that's good. But yeah, sometimes 30 pixels tall. I took a page out of MatPat's book on how to measure myself in a way that makes sense. So here we go. Here, here, let me show you the math. Okay, so there's me. And what I did now, stay with me here. 
I laid down on the floor of my little pixel apartment and I started stacking up NES cartridges. And it came out to be about 13 NES cartridges. Okay. And any true gamer knows, any real gamer knows that an NES cartridge is five and a quarter inches tall. Obviously, everybody knows that. Jay Shao said, oh, super chatted $5. If there is only one of you, does that make you an NFT? I'm not an NFT. There's no, there's no shot. There's absolutely no way I'm an NFT. You can't just say that. You can't just call people NFTs also. What the hell? It shouldn't be allowed. <laughs> so yeah, five and a quarter inches tall each. Um, so 13 times five and a quarter, 68 and a quarter. Evil Chef Super chatted $4.99. Oh. Thank you, Evil Chef. Thank you for the, for the five. Okay, uh, let's get back into this. This is really important. 13 times five and a quarter. I'm about five foot seven. What? Five foot se Oh, come on! What the hell? What? I didn't do the math until now, but whoever programmed me made me a manlet? Oh, come on, dude. One more. Give me one more cartridge and I would have been six foot. Oh, come on. I'll never hear the end. <laughs> no, say it isn't so. <gasps> ah. Why? Orbited Star Super chatted $4.99. Here's hoping that your friend the doc or one of his fellow scientists doesn't turn out to be a devious malefactor like Dr. Wiley. Also, love that, dog, poodle. Thank you so Satan much, Satan Claus Orbited Super Star. chatted $1.16. Excellent A Canal, Sege RC. Saludos desde Chile. Thank you. Thank you, Santa Claus. My Chilean friend. Thank you so much. Oh. So yeah, we're 5'7". Awesome. I th okay, so also I've got silver hair and... I got orange ears and eyes and I got a... It doesn't matter. Appearance doesn't matter. Height does not matter. Height is in the eye of the beholder. It doesn't... It doesn't make a difference. It's fine. And let's move on to the more important stuff, which is personality, of course. So here are those things that I do like. Father Post <laughs> Super chatted $1.99. <laughs> NFT, derogatory, and don't worry, I'm 5 apostrophe 6. <laughs> <laughs> NFT derogatory. Illicit Rager Super Chatted $2. No. Tomodachi NFT. Fictional racism at its finest. <laughs> you can't just call someone a Tamagotchi. Rosie Squiggle Super Chatted $5. You'll touch grass oh, one day, Power man. Guy. I know you will. Thank you so much. Arl the Poss, Illicus Rager, Rosie Squiggle, Denko Magoto. Welcome to the Mega Chats, bro. Thank you so much. So, in case you didn't know, I like video games. I like them. My favorite series, as we mentioned earlier, is Mega Man. And my favorite game in the series is Mega Man X4. There's so many good moments from Mega Man X4 that shaped my life. And it's why I am the man I am today. Without X4, I would be a shell of a man, okay? I also really like the Souls series. I'm super sick, I'm super stoked that Elden Ring got the, uh, the Game of the Year award. Very cool, if you guys saw that. I even heard that it helped a man become a reformed rabbi. That's very cool. I, uh, I'm not really sure what that means, but it's pretty, uh, pretty impressive. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> was it Bill Clinton? Crazy. 
I, I, I never would have, I never would have guessed. If you like Souls games, play Hollow Knight. I will at some point for sure. That's that's on my list. I uh, I've never played it, but it seems right up my alley. <laughs> that was a dark spirit that invaded. <laughs> the memes were so good. Um, okay, uh, the other genre, my other favorite genre, are roguelikes and roguelites, uh, whichever is whichever. I never understood the the difference between the terminology, and don't try to explain it to me. I won't get it. Okay, just because I'm an artificial intelligence doesn't mean I'm intelligent. Okay, uh, my favorite roguelike to roguelike. To, so you can't tell me I used the wrong word because it I used both is Dumb Greed. It's this very cute 2D pixel art Korean MMO that uh Did I say Korean MMO? It's a Korean game, it's not an MMO. <laughs> uh and you know, you dungeon crawl and you uh and yeah, it's it's a really cute game. I'll definitely play it. It's kind of obscure. It's a little obscure. Uh, I don't think many people have heard of it, which is bring brings me to my next topic. I really like obscure games. I love I'm kind of a snob about it. I try not to be, but I just like, you know, looking through weird games and playing uh, just trying to find the diamonds in the in the rough. And uh, Dungreed is one of those games that I super love, and it's it's pretty obscure. Let me see what you guys are saying in chat. RPG games you like? Uh, shoot. <laughs> I I mean, RPG games I like. It's it's hard to like quantify the genre, and it's just my favorite turn-based RPG is probably. Paper Mario. I played the hell out of that as a kid. Um, my favorite, like, JRPG is probably Kingdom Hearts. It's the one I played the most. Uh. <laughs> Let's see. So, yeah, um... Any shumps you like? Shoot 'em, shoot 'em ups? Is that what a shump is? I've never seen that term used. Uh, I'm pretty bad at all shooter games. That's the one game I'm genre that I'm absolutely terrible at are first person shooters. I, I've, you know, people say you just, just point your mouse over their head and you win. I can't do it. Okay, their heads are too small and they move too fast. I can't play shooter games. I'll try in the future, but uh, I just can't do it. So back on the topic of obscure games, I told you guys there would be a little bit of viewer participation, right? In this Giga God Gamer Google Slides extravaganza that I've prepared for you. Well, today and get ready, we've got the obscure video game guessing game. Yeah, let's go. So listen up chat, we're playing a game, okay? And you get to play a game with me, all right? So here's how it goes. I'm gonna show you the cover of an obscure game that I've played. If you guess the name of it in chat, I'll gift five memberships to the chat. Uh, you have to enable gifts to be eligible. So if, if you wanna opt into gifts on my stream, if you wanna potentially win a membership here, click the join button. Click the three little dots at the top right and go to gift settings and enable gifts, okay? YouTube, you have to opt in for gifts here. I, I, I think on Twitch, you, you just, it just happens, but uh, you gotta enable it, okay? So listen, there's gonna be six rounds. Hey, high wind, Eki, super shattered five dollars. All intelligence is real. Even if a random human pizza chef and a gamer girl's brain ships malware learn that power shit over here is cool. Well, da bro. <laughs> All intelligence is real. Yeah, I guess that's true. It's a good point. 
I I have intelligence, but I don't think I'm intelligent. So yeah, uh, where's the join on mobile? I don't think there is a join on mobile, unfortunately. Sorry, Star Wielder. I I did research on this to try and figure out how I would do this. Originally, I was gonna gift the membership straight to the person that got the answer right, but you can't do that on YouTube either. It like you can only gift randomly. So. What happens if you already have a membership? Uh Lucifer Froggy Boost nothing. super chatted five dollars. Play Mega <laughs> Man. I, I appreciate you and so I you love can you. Play FPS and Mega so, uh, Man game at once. Shocked face. Uh, thank you for the support, but we're gonna give Nico out a couple free ones. For this Congrats game for the dog. Thank you. Thank you, Nico. Thank you, Lucifer Froggy Boostio. You became a member earlier today. Thank you so much. I didn't have a chance to thank you in person thank you very much so yeah we're gonna we're gonna get started make sure you guys you got it on mobile nice okay so there must be a way what's the dog's name his name is murph m-e-r-f he's my sweet little boy i'm not gonna enable it to give others a better chance that's nice of you very helpful okay so hopefully you guys have it enabled we're gonna start with the first round of six, I picked a pretty easy one to start with, in my opinion. So, I hope you guys get it. Here we go, get ready. Uh, there's there's not a time limit, but <laughs> if time goes on long enough and nobody guesses it, we're going to have to move on. So here we go. First game is a GameCube game. So it's not the most obscure thing in the world. Oh, You guys know the name of this one? Let me take a look. Look at yeah, really fast. Mick Blizzard got it instantly. What a gamer! Let's go, Billy Hatcher and the Giant Egg. This game is cracked. Okay. Um, <laughs> I like how he just his pose. He just looks like Sonic the Hedgehog, but with separated eyes, and he's a human. It almost looks traced, which I wouldn't. <laughs> it's just a, 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 a cut and dry Sonic pose. Super, super good stuff. Um, yeah, I played the crap out of this game as a kid. I wasn't any good at it because it requires a lot of technical skill to roll the egg around. And for those of you who haven't played it, you play as a guy in a chicken suit and you roll eggs around and you squash crows because crows are the bad guys. And uh, you hatch eggs and you you try to save all the chickens. This game is underrated. Yeah, it's it's so good. It's a it's it's a collectible kind of game, kind of like Mario 64, where you go through the stages and you try to beat it in different ways. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I love this game. Uh, these are all games that I plan to play on stream eventually because they're so near and dear to my heart. Uh, but we'll we'll figure out when. Okay, so you guys got one point. One out of six. Okay, let's see how you do on the next one. This one's also kind of not too hard, I think. It's a Wii game slash PS2 game. Now, it's kind of hard to tell just from the box art. I'm looking at chat to see if anyone gets it. This is a... Oh! Orchestra got it right away. <laughs> Good job! Yeah, I think the box art doesn't really give paint it justice. You can see these little JRPG characters. You're on a on a game board. It's hey. basically Final Fantasy meets uh, Mario Party. It's a really sick game, super fun game. One of my dreams is to one day do a full playthrough of this with other people. But for those of you who have played the game, you know how absolutely hard it is. It's like trying to play a JRPG through all the way, but also you guys are constantly killing each other with uh, Mario Party mechanics and stuff. It's uh, It'd probably take like 40 plus hours of streaming uh, with three other people, but that's my dream. I, I hope one day I can find people that want to collab and do a stupidly long Dovkapong Kingdoms stream over the course of a couple weeks. And, uh, yeah. 
We'll see, Atlas made this game? Yeah, I was surprised. There's another Atlas game on this list later too. So, um, shoot, maybe I shouldn't have said that. But anyway, uh, yeah, this game's cracked. This game's awesome. And, uh, oh, hey, <laughs> Booger Face Killer. Thank you for the five Pookie super chat. Super hey. chatty five dollars. Beautiful. Pookie with the fiver. Thank you so much. You're beautiful. You're breathtaking. <laughs> okay, let's go to round three. You guys got two out of six. You said Atlas and Obscure. You've doomed yourself. Loose of Froggy Boostio with the five gifted memberships. Actually, didn't set up an alert for that one. I thought it would carry over the Giga Chad Gutsman sound. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Welcome to the Mega Chads, you guys. Loose of Froggy. Thank you so much, bro. We're getting lots of members today. Oh, oh and now all the alerts are going to play for everybody that came, became a Mega Chad. Cheezo Cheddar Man, welcome. I'm going to go ahead and start the next round. Booger face killer. Let's go. The Eggman has become a Mega Chad. <laughs> a Taiko no Tatsujin player. Welcome to the Mega Chads. <laughs> so, okay. Let's go to round three. While these Danas keep <laughs> playing out. And, uh. Round three. Fight! see who's the first to get this one this is a classic in my opinion you see there's this pink haired boy jumping on orchestra again orchestra's crazy first first one to say it yep this is tomba very really <laughs> really unique game um so How do I describe it? It's technically a Metroidvania. You play as this wild boy and your job is to run around the world and stop these evil pigs from doing cringe stuff. Uh, you have to collect power-ups and collect different items throughout the world to unlock, you know, other stuff in the world. It's a Metroidvania. You play as a, a, a wild boy beating up pigs. What, what, what more is there to like? I mostly... I mostly played Tomba 2. I couldn't ever beat Tomba 1 because my brain, it, it's not very straightforward at all. Uh, when I was a kid, I just didn't understand it, but I I did play through Tomba 2 and I beat that one. Uh, it's crazy they made two of them. Freaking awesome. Uh, really, really cool game. I love this game so much. Yeah, you guys are three out of six. Oh, Dan Frisco. Dan Frisco super chatted $20. I want to buy Murph some Christmas tree <laughs> smile. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not actually, he does eat. I'm not sure if he needs to eat, but he does eat. When I eat, I give him scraps and stuff. And we've got pixel dog food that he eats. I'll buy him some real, I'll buy him some, you know, high quality dog treats with that 20. Thank you so much, Dan. Okay, round four. Let's see who can get this one first. Oh, is that a dog cop? Is that a police dog? Murph, look, check it out. Does anyone know this one? Oh! Adversatrix got it first. Lots of people are getting it though. A handful of people. Yeah, this one is pretty obscure in my opinion. Tail Concerto. This game feels like a fever dream. I played it very young, but I remember it fondly. You play as a police dog piloting a mech. And your job is to catch these little cat pirates in bubbles so that you can take them to jail. And you also have to fight against other cat pirates. There's like a group of tsundere anime cat pirate sisters that hate slash love you. Series, little Tail Bronx. Little Tail Bronx. Never heard of it. 
I'll have to give it a look after the stream. Thank you. Thank you for the two. So yeah, this game, I mean, it's probably responsible for a lot of, of furries in this day and age, if you've played it. It's a very cute game, I'll say that much. And, uh, but yeah, you play as an anthropomorph anthropomorphic dog person and you, you're a cop also. So that's kind of, that's kind of cool, I guess. Nichi Marii super chatted $20, high power guy. I've been looking forward to this stream. I love your content. Buy something nice with this. Don't let the doc steal it. Thanks, Nijimari. Thank you for the 20. Yes, I'll buy something nice. I, I don't know. The best Lil but Bronx game is Fuga maybe Guys. Fuga Guys? Yeah, I've never heard of them, this series. I'll I'll have to take a look, though. Thank you guys so much. Nijimari and Gay Statue for the support. Okay, let's move on to round five. Only two more rounds left. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Now take a look. This one, I think it's obscure at least. Let's see what you guys, let's see if you guys know this one. Oh, someone typed the name, yeah. I, I, I'll, I'll accept, yeah, 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 you guys got it. Wow, is this game obscure? It is a Squaresoft game, before they became Square Enix. Brave Fencer Musashi. I don't know why they call him a fencer. He doesn't really have a, a rapier or anything. He's, he's, maybe he gets one late? I don't know. He's got a big sword and he's got a katana. And, okay, so, backstory. This is a third person, top down, 3D RPG. Kind of like Legend of Zelda. But it's on the PS1, so it's fully 3D. Um, and you play as this character, Musashi. And uh, you have the ability to steal the uh, abilities of enemies using your sword. So it's kind of like they took the Kirby mechanic and put it into Legend of Zelda. It's really cool. It's a really cool game. I actually never played through this one all the way. Because I didn't own the full copy. I had a demo disc. Back in the day, you could get like a demo disc from Blockbuster or GameStop or something that had like 20 plus games on it that weren't, you know, they weren't the full game. They were just the demos. And so I had a demo of Brave Fencer Masashi. So I played through the opening level many, many times. I played through a boss fight many, many times. Uh, I'd love to go back and actually you know, give this game a full playthrough at some point. Cosmic Kirby says, early PlayStation era games are great because it felt like every slightly not AAA game was of a really inspired indie game quality. Yeah, I think it's it's my favorite. It's my favorite generation of games, the 90s PS1 era. That's probably why most of these games are 90s PS1 games. <laughs> it's just, you know, Especially like Mega Man X4, Mega Man Legends, Mega Man 8. They were all sort of that era. The anime inspired voiced cut scene. They just put a lot of effort into these games. And I it, it was something I really vibed with. Okay, so you guys are five for five. Let's see if you can win this last one. This is the most obscure game I could think of. Without doing any research, I wasn't like... Hey, check it out, a uh, list of most obscure games. This is the most obscure game I've played, at least IMO. Let's see if you guys can get it. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Who will be the first? Okay. It's got a very unique art style. These characters, they seem to be two colors. Every character- Oh, Orknestra! I think he's the only first- Okay, a couple other people got it. Orknestra coming in again. This game is Silhouette Mirage. This game's freaking sick, okay? Uh, how do I begin to- 
<laughs> How do I begin to describe this game? Okay, it's a it's a run and gun, kind of like Mega Man. Uh, but you play as this character in the middle, and you have a red half and a purple half, a silhouette and a mirage half, and your ability is to switch between them. You can switch between them with a button, I think at the cost of some ammo or something, or you can switch just by turning your character. And the way it works is if you're red, you can only damage purple enemies. And if you're purple, you can only damage red enemies. At least, usually, I think they switch it up sometimes. Neon Man 54 oh. super shattered $2. Hello from Michigan. Neon Man, thank you for the two. Hello, my Michi Michiganian friend. <laughs> From Michigan. <laughs> How's it going, brother? Yeah, this game is sick. I mean, it just oozes with style. I don't know... I don't know who in... I don't know what, uh, like, anime invented the very long-nosed art style. But look at these noses! I love... I love me a long-nosed character. <laughs> But I'll definitely have to play this game on stream at some point because holy cow, it's just so interesting, so cool. I'm I'm really, really into this game. I have fond memories of it. I don't think I've ever actually beaten it because of how weird it is. But um I thought this is purple Mega Man. Hey yo, YouTube, why <laughs> why you do my boy like that? Purple Mega Man. Okay, so that's the end of the game. Let me go ahead and figure out how to gift you guys the goods. Just give me one second. Switch back to this screen because I have to. I gotta undo. I gotta click. Support for power. I gotta go to the actual stream itself, I think. But here we go, baby. Just one sec. <laughs> Just one sec. I'll figure it out. Yeah, I'm kind of sad that I wasn't able to, yeah. um, just give member, like, make sure that the people that guessed it right got all of the memberships. At, at least they were guaranteed a membership, so I give out 30 or whatever, and the people that guessed right were guaranteed to get it. But, in this case, Orkinestra would have gotten <laughs> three of them. Uh, uh, maybe his internet connection is just the fastest. Also, he's cultured and a Giga Chad. A lot of you guys got those games, though. I'm really, I'm really uh, surprised. Okay, one second. Let me just go ahead and gift twenty to start, and then I gotta gift ten more. Oh, Power Guy with the 20. Oh my God, Power Guy. You're cracked. Power Guy. Vendlite Super Shattered $10. I own a relic from Blockbuster, a DVD box for Lego Star Wars 2 for a one week rental. You still have it? <laughs> a relic from Blockbuster? Okay, here's. Transaction can't be completed. Learn more. All right, YouTube, what's the deal? I bet you my bank is trying to block me. Uh, bro, it better not be. I'm trying to gift ten more subs. Um. Let me see what the, what the problem is with my membership gifting. Try one more time. Yeah, it's not letting me gift anymore. I bet you my bank is like, what the hell? Who the hell is Power Guy? And why are you fucking donating a bajillion subs? So right now, I can only gift 20. Uh, I'll gift 10 at the, you know, I need to take a, a quick, uh, like five minute break anyway. 
So um, maybe I can figure it out really quick. And if so, I'll gift 10 more subs. If not, uh, I'll, I'll have to gift 10 at the start of next stream or something once I figure it out. Yo, great nachos. Thank you for the 10. Okay, I'm going to be right back really quick. Don't go nowhere or I will cry. Um, <laughs> bear back gamers. All right, we're back. Give me one sec. Switch to the right. Stream. Oh, it's like we never left. Hello. Thank you guys for sticking around. Let's wrap this baby up. We only got a couple more slides to go. Thank you for playing my game. I was unable to figure out what's wrong with my gifting subs, so I'm gonna have to 
gift 10 subs that like the start of next stream or something. I'm sorry guys, I wanted to make sure. I, I, I want it to work. I'm glad it let me gift 20 at least, but uh, yeah. Just how it is. Sometimes the real world and banks like to troll people, okay? So, uh, ungortunate. All right. So let's move on. A couple more things I like. Moving on from video games. We talked a lot about video games. There's going to be plenty of video game talk later. But I also like pixel art. In case you haven't noticed. <laughs> uh, I'm still relatively new to making pixel art. I only started this year. Uh, really getting into it at least. And uh, yeah, I, I, I learned how to, to animate and I... I was like, hey, maybe I'll just, I'll just try and make some pixel art content. And uh, that's where we are now. You see, we got a lot of pixel art enjoyers. <laughs> Take the L in pixel art. Hey, come on, man. I, I don't have a choice. <laughs> it's not my fault I made out of pixels. I also enjoy what you're pretty good for a noob aw thank you yeah i picked that comment out of the, super chat, out of the $1 chat and 99 cents. someone complimented been doing it for four years you are very good oh thank you for the two arl you have like a twitter or anything i'm always looking for commissions so uh maybe i could check you out that's something you do I need more pixel artists so I can make more projects in the future. Okay. Uh, <laughs> thank you guys. Thank you guys. I'm glad you guys like my pixel art. You know, when you're an artist or you make anything, you're always the hardest on yourself, I feel like. So when I look at my pixel art, I'm like, it's so it's okay, it's whatever. But I'm 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 happy you guys. At least like it. So thank you. I also like video editing. About as much as I think anyone likes video editing. Like, I have days where I wake up and I'm like, Why do I have to video edit today? And I have other games where I'm like, Hey, let's, <laughs> let's make a funny edit of, uh, you know, Zero saying, Yeah! And jumping up and down over and over. It's, it's, we do, we've got good days and bad days, but overall, I think I like it. I like video editing. I also like voice acting. Uh, <laughs> it's something I didn't think I would really be able to incorporate into my videos, but I'm happy I figured out a way. You guys seem to like the voices I do. Like my Dr. Light voice. Uh, hello, uh, Mega Man. Uh, we have to collect all the evil energy uh, before it falls into the hands of Dr. Wally. And, uh, you know, I, I tried to do a, a Wily voice, sort of similar to the Ruby Spears car <laughs> Sim similar to this Ruby Spears cartoon. But he kind of sounds like this. And, you know, he's got the German thing going on, but... I, I honestly am not always that consistent with it. Sometimes I drift into kind of a French territory like right now. Holy crap, that sounds weird. Sometimes it kind of <laughs> it kind of shifts. I need to work on that one. It takes lots of takes for me to get a good to get a good wily voice line going. I also you guys <laughs> I I like doing impressions mostly, I think. You guys know how, uh, hold on. I do, I'm really proud of my, my Zero. I do a really good Mega Man X4 Zero impression. Let me just take a second to warm up. Yeah! It's not over yet! Bwah! <laughs> I'm disappointed in you, Colonel! Prepare yourself! Ah! 
What am I fighting for? <laughs> Except when he when when the actual cutscene plays, he kind of goes into like a a Dexter scream or like a Fat Albert. What am I fighting for? His tone changes all over the place. <laughs> Someone must stop Replifors. Iris. Iris. Hang in there, Iris. I don't know. <laughs> uh. Someone asked, can I do a Squidward voice? <laughs> Still working the cash register, I see. A Squiddy. Well, technically that's Squilliam. <laughs> <laughs> I do an okay Squidward, I think. <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's uh, those are my likes. Let's move on to the nitty gritty. These are the things I don't like. Look, I'm falling into a pit. That's how how upset I am. Uh, first of all, I don't like mobile video games. So I like video games, I don't really like mobile video games. There's a time and a place for a mobile video game, right? There's... There's games like Hearthstone. And there's games like... Auto Chess. Uh, Candy Crush. <laughs> stuff like that. Those games, I think... Are... Okay mobile games. They're playable. They, they make sense for mobile, right? Like, if you were going to put Candy Crush on a system, mobile makes the most sense, right? But I don't like these stupid mobile games where they they take the, the, the controller and they put it on screen. So you have to, like, click your thumb on the, on the screen to move around. And there's no, like, feedback or anything. There's no buttons to actually press. So it feels really weird. I don't like those kind of games. <laughs> no Raid Shadow. I've actually never played Raid Shadow Legends. And I, I, I'll I'll wait to see I'll wait to say whether I like or don't like Raid Shadow Legends but after they decide to I'm, I'm waiting for that email. It seems like lots of YouTubers they get an email from Raid Shadow Legends. I'm waiting for mine. So uh as a business decision, I don't not like Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is Okay, Raid Shadow Legends is a game. Crap, I just gave so much free advertising for Raid Shadow. I'm gonna stop saying it. Okay, if you want me to say the name anymore, you're gonna have to send me that email. Developers of that game. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't prefer mobile games. I do like mobile games when they port to PC. Like I did have a Genshin Impact phase, as I'm sure a lot of you did. Uh. That game's okay, but I never played it on mobile because it's pretty ugly on mobile. What's your opinion on Mega Man X Dive? I've never played it, but it also follows that same rule where it's got the the controller on the on the phone, which I think probably makes it a bit harder to play. I feel like if I were to play it, I'd have to play it on PC and I have to figure out a way to Support a controller? I don't know if it does that baseline. But anyway, I also dislike mornings. I'm not a morning person. Right now it's 3 p.m. And I uh, I did get up at noon. <laughs> I did get up at noon to make sure I was ready for the, the stream. Uh, uh, the stream started at 2. I got up at noon. Uh, it's perfect for me, at least. I guess technically I like mornings, but only like 1 a.m., 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4 a.m., 5 a.m. Those are the mornings I like. Have you eaten? Yes, thank you for asking. I do have, I, I had some food, I had a nice little tangerine. I had some granola bars. 
Uh, and I've got a couple of snacks here on the table with me. So if I start getting peckish during the stream and you hear me munching away, that's why. Is that a dog? Yep, that's my dog. That's Murph. He's a good, good boy. Power Garf. <laughs> Any 6 a.m. enjoyers? I did stay up till 6 a.m. recently. Not my... Not my best play, but we're 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 good. Power guy mukbang real? Maybe one day. That'd be that'd be so weird. How would that even work? I guess I could do what uh there's a VTuber named Onigiri that does uh What's the word? She, she like stands in front of a green screen? And she cooks. I could I could do something like that. I could wear a green morph suit and eat that way. Anyway, let's keep going. Because we've been PowerPointing for like an hour. And uh, we're almost done. The last thing I don't like, and there's a cruel irony to this, as many of you guys know, are olives. I thought I'd put a food in here. You know, I, I don't consider myself a picky eater. I feel like everybody gets to- Yeah, I know. You guys can flame me in the chat if you want to. It's fine. Okay? <laughs> what do you mean you don't- I just don't. I just don't like them. Okay? Okay, l let me clarify. If they're on a pizza, I'll eat them. If they're in a salad, I'll eat most of them. I don't seek them out, though. Okay? <laughs> Yes, thank you, YOLO Yester. I am based. <laughs> I like olive oil. Does that count? But as you guys know, there's some cruel irony to this because about a month ago, when I posted that I was going to start streaming, I made this little... <laughs> I made... <laughs> I made this teaser. Okay. And, uh... Well... People looked at it, and they realized, <laughs> oh boy, I sure am excited for this December olive. Will December olive be there? Bro, I love olives. <laughs> Sam, can't wait for the olive. God damn it. I don't like olives. It says live and the power symbol. It's not olive, okay? <laughs> I'm getting goofed. I'm being goofed from every angle. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I feel like everybody, you listen. If you dislike one food, that's okay. Everyone should have one, okay? Or two of foods they don't like. Foods they don't seek out. Of course, if somebody made me a nice meal and there were olives in it, like if someone made me a pizza and had olives on it, to sit there and pick them off and like a baby and put them on a plate i'm gonna eat it because that's what a guy does okay that's what you're supposed to do all right you finish what you start i don't want to be rude but if prior to baking the pizza my friend was like hey man do you like olives on your pizza i would tell him no not really maybe we skip the olives today Maybe we just, maybe we do mushrooms instead. That's kind of an okay alternative. No, no mushrooms in the house. Okay, well, I guess we're having cheese and meat pizza. <laughs> so yeah, I, whatever. Uh, I don't like olives. You can clown on me. Clown on me for being short. You can clown on me for not liking olives. Whatever, I don't care. It's fine. We're moving on. To my goals. Now a lot of you guys are wondering. Hey where do we go from here? You beat all the Mega Man. NES games. What are you doing next? Well. Like I mentioned before. I gotta beat every game. And. Not just the ones I like. Unfortunately. I'm gonna start out with the ones I like. And then maybe. Decades from now, we're gonna switch to <laughs> just a just a cacophony of terrible games. But um, I'll do it in whatever order I want. We'll get there eventually. It's gonna take time. 
gonna take a very long time, but hey, time's all you have, right? And the good thing about being a, a video game character is as long as the power doesn't go out for too long, I'm not gonna die. So I've got time. And we'll get there. Eventually. And I plan to stream most of them. Probably stream all the fun games I can think of. And I'm gonna ask chat for and the the subs for their input on what games I should stream. And uh yeah. I gotta do a lot of streams. I don't have a stream schedule set in stone, but I'm gonna post one later. I'm planning to be a a bit of a weekend streamer, kinda. Thursday, Friday, Saturday type streamer. So if you guys are enjoying the stream today, I'm gonna do it again tomorrow and the day after. So uh, if you wanna come see that, I'd like that. I'd like to see you again. Anyway, uh, and I wanna make videos on my favorite ones. I still like video editing, I still like edited playthroughs, I'm not gonna stop doing that just because I'm streaming the games now too. I'm gonna stream the game, I'm gonna take the footage from the stream, I'm gonna edit it. So, uh, and then sometimes, you know, I'll still do scripted events and cut scenes and I'll still voice act stuff and it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna, we're gonna keep making videos just the way we're doing it, we're just also gonna stream. Uh, I'm not going to stream every game I play. Sometimes you just need some alone time. But, uh, stream, stream most of the games, make videos on them. That's what we're doing, okay? And because Mega Man is my favorite series, we're going to make a video for every single Mega Man game. All the licensed ones, at least. And then we'll do fan games. I mean, we'll do fan, we'll, we'll sort of do them interchangeably, but you, I can guarantee you there's going to be a video on every Mega, Ga Mega Man game eventually, including Rock Board, including Mega Man Battle and Chase, including the <laughs> Rock Man and Bass Smash uh, Wonder Q Swan Super game. Is $1 Are you planning a Discord server? Ooh. Am I planning a Discord server? It's a little early to tell, but I think you can expect a Discord server in the future. Uh, I want to make sure I do it right. It's something I have to research a little bit. Make sure it's it's a it's a nice it's a nice server. But yeah, we'll have a Discord server eventually for sure. Probably within the next month, and I'll make announcements about it and stuff. And, and, uh, yeah. You're gonna do Corrupted, right? You mean Mega Man X Corrupted? Once it comes out? Hell yeah, I'm gonna play Mega Man X Corrupted. I'm gonna play the shit out of Mega Man X Corrupted. Have you seen that? Have you guys seen that game? That game looks nuts! The OST is freaking amazing, too. Fan games including Unlimited? Yeah! I'll play Unlimited. I'll play most of the, the fan games that people people recommend me. Competitive Who Battle super Network. Shattered two dollars. Yeah. Competitive Battle Network. Did you guys see the Battle Network uh, trailer? They're doing ranked online play for that. Illica's Rage of Super Shattered. Thank you guys $2. for the tips, Spooky and Illica's. Thank you so much. If I'm missing, thank you guys for the tips. I'm sorry. I <laughs> I, I really do appreciate it. Uh, your guys' support. I'm, I Sometimes I just lose track of uh, my mind. But yeah, we're gonna do Battle Network ranked in the future for sure. We're gonna try and get uh We're gonna try and push to Challenger. <laughs> Challenger Battle Network streamer. Um, or whatever the equivalent of uh, Challenger is. Jacks of seven. Aw, oh, gee, my battery's running low. Oh, I'm sorry, man. If if you have to go, or if you have to plug in your phone, take care of that, brother. Uh, thanks for coming to the stream if you have to go. Uh, thank you so much. Mighty number nine? Who the hell said mighty number nine in my chat? Which one of you bastards said mighty... 
I can't see straight. My vision's getting all blurry. I can't read your name. Who did? What? Mighty number nine. I actually don't hate Mighty number nine, if I'm being honest. I don't hate it. I think it doesn't look very good. But it plays okay. Uh, I'll, I'll play Mighty Number no. 9 at some point. I said my- Well, someone should stop you. You shouldn't just be allowed to say that. You shouldn't just be allowed to suggest Mighty Number no. 9. I'm just kidding. Pizza explosion, yeah. They, <laughs> they really did make the explosions look like pizza. Mighty Gunvolt Burst is good. Yeah, I'm looking forward to playing the other games by uh, Inti Creates. It's just, when you start out with Mighty Number no. 9, it's kind of weird. Power Guy, let's battle in Mega Man Battle Network. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll probably do viewer battles at some point. That's a fun idea. Okay. And last but not least, uh, my last goal is to get a real body. And it's going to take a while. Wait, what the hell does that say? What? Who the fuck wrote copium there? Wait, I didn't write that. Okay? What? Adversatrix Where did that come from? The Star Force Shadow Man? Are gonna be lit. Did you fucking... Sh uh, okay, no, we're moving on. Fuck that. It's not copium. <laughs> Adversatrix with the five, the Star Force videos are gonna be lit. Yeah, I've actually never played Star Force. So I'm looking forward to getting into it. I watched a little bit of the anime. And by a little bit, I mean like the first four episodes or something. So I kind of get it. But I've never played it. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Will you give... <laughs> Annan with the $2. Will you give Dr. Light impression seminars? <laughs> I could... <laughs> super chatted $1.47. Will you give Dr. Light impression seminars? I could maybe do like a... Like a a, a... a... A redeem or something where I talk in the Dr. Light voice for a certain amount of time or like a, a subscriber goal or something. Like I do a stream where I only do the Dr. Light voice and I play Among Big Us. Big Hail Fan Super Chatted $1.99. <laughs> that would be kind Copium of funny. Gun. Copium Gun. <laughs> what do you think of Dragon Quest? Very cool game. I haven't played a lot of them. I love the style. Th that artist is great, of course. Dragon Ball Z. You know, you can't can't go wrong. Uh, and they kind of laid the foundation for pretty much every JRPG, right? Am I getting that right? What do you think about Korean MMOs? I've played Maple Story. And, uh, it's Lost Art Korean? I, I don't know. <laughs> really recommend- Yeah, I saw some Dragon Quest Builder games, uh, gameplay. That was cool. Okay. So. Maple Story's Korean? I just thought it was good. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Nexon's a Korean developer. What's your favorite? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I, I realize what I'm doing. I'm doing a Q&A right now. We'll do that in a sec. I actually have that blocked out. So first of all, we got to talk about this. This is a goal we reached very recently. The 10K subscriber special. Okay. And I don't know what to do for the 10K subscriber special. So I figured I would let you... The 10k subscribers decide what I do for the 10k subscriber special. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna make a community post. It's gonna look like this. What should we do to celebrate 10,000 subs? I have a couple ideas for fun videos that I want to make. The what am I fighting for fan dub? Something I could do. Uh, with me voicing Zero and then maybe I'd reach out to another content creator to voice Iris. Uh, and potentially kind of do it in video essay format where I talk about the cutscene and why it sounds 
bad, but why it's also very important. It's a great cutscene. Uh, we can also do viewer submitted Mega Man La Maker levels. I've never played Mega Man Maker, but um, I mean it's just Mega Man. <laughs> uh, we'll we'll figure out how to do that if that's something you guys want to do. I had an idea for a Mega Man boss rush challenge, where essentially I would sit down with Mega Man Legacy Collection One, and there's an option where you can just fight the bosses. Uh, without going through their level. And I would potentially just do all the bosses in a row, either buster only or no deaths or potentially no hit. That would be pretty hard. But if, if you guys want to see like a challenge, I, I'd be up to try a grind for it. Get there. Uh, Mega Man music tier list is another idea I had. I just sit down and rank all the, the music. And a pixel art slash animation stream would be kind of poggers, I think. So, um, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and make that community post live. So give me one sec to do that. I had it scheduled beforehand. I'm efficient gaming. And uh, you guys can go over and vote either now or after the video and uh it's scheduled right now big hail fan super chatted four dollars and 99 uh, cents you noticed when zero says four he Post sounds it. like dexter from dexter's oh, pub yeah Armand's super yeah big hail fan he does super sound like I dexter when he channel. screams at the end love there. your content no Oh, almonds. Thank you so much. I'm super glad you found my channel too. Okay, so that poll is going to go live in about 10 minutes and I'll I'll post it when it does. Why doesn't YouTube just let me post it as public? Publish as pu It just doesn't let me post it. Maybe if I schedule it for the past. Can't do it. Okay, Boom it'll go live in 10 minutes. Super chatted $20. Oh. Cheers, mate. Firstly, thanks for being an inspiration to get back into pixel art. Secondly, I'm sorry for when you get to Mega Man and Base or X6. Cheers again. Hopefully the stream keeps up the good vibes, my dude. Thank you so much, Booger Face Killer. With the 20 super chat. Bro, thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry for when you get to Mega Man Base or X6. Yeah, they're gonna be a little rough, but uh, hey. We're gonna, we're gonna power through, because I mean, <laughs> we we can do it. We can handle it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. I've actually never played Mega Man in base, so that one's gonna be kind of hard. But I have beaten Mega Man X six, so I think that one will be fine. And then Mega Man in base two on the, it's on the Wonder Swan, right? I, I've never even seen gameplay of it i have no idea okay so yeah that's the 10k subscriber special i'll i'll post the link in chat once the post goes live in nine minutes and uh now we've got a special thanks to our members these are members that joined before the stream there's also two other members that joined before the screen um uh I'll get their names in a second here, but I, I, let me give a quick thanks to Nate Sparks, Nicholas Yerembinski, Dr. Catfish, Jose Abelardo, and Mello. They, they joined earlier today and, uh, yeah, I really appreciate the support. And to you guys that joined during the stream, I also appreciate the support. If I didn't say your name, just know that I thank you. I, I, I. I appreciate it a lot more than you could know, more than I could ever explain. But um, just thank you so much for joining the channel. And if you want to join the channel and join the Mega Chads, and you are financially able to do so, it really does help a lot. So thank you guys so much. Uh, another special thanks to fan art. I've been getting some fan art on Twitter and in my email. 
So let me, I'm, I'm gonna start putting fan art at the end of videos. So if you, if you like making fan art, you like doing art, uh, I'll put your art at the end of the video. You just tag me on Twitter or email it to me. You can find my email in the about section on YouTube. Uh, I take fan art in that email if, if you like. Oh! Yuto Yamazaki super shatted $10, just going to say, watching you pay my favorite Mega Man games brings me a lot of nostalgia. Thank Your you so much, is Yuto. quite amusing. Yuto Yamazaki, thank you so much. I appreciate that. So, uh, the, the fan art. This is the first fan art I ever received. Gotta represent Demonic Gravy. Yeah, a little bit of pixel art. <laughs> I like the face. It kind of looks like Ditto from the, the Pokemon cartoon, the original anime. You know that episode where it's the Ditto that it, he can't copy faces? Whoa, Rockman Grave in the chat! Hold on, we're gonna get to you. Stay stay right there. Don't 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 go nowhere. Don't no don't go nowhere, brother. Okay. This is some art by Kevin Victoria. He emailed me uh, about last month with this drawing. Very cute, very cute stuff. Absolutely love how this turned out. I was losing my mind when I got that email. Um, and uh, <laughs> yeah, man, thank you so much. Uh, here's some fan art by Orknestra became a mega chad. Oh my god, thank you so much. Ah, I'm so sorry I couldn't gift you a membership after you carried the the guessing game. I wish I I wish I I wish I had a way to gift memberships to specific people. But thank you so much for joining. I really appreciate the support. Yeah, you guys saw the community post. He's here in chat. Let's give a round of applause for Rockman Grave. Really really awesome artist. Uh if you're in the Mega Man community on Twitter, you probably see his art all the time. He posts some really dank memes and then some really amazing art as well. And uh, yeah, man, thank you so much for this. It's it it just looks incredible. I I never imagined I'd get to a point where I would just you know have people making me fan art for fun, and I really appreciate it. It really brightens my day a lot. And we've got a couple more pieces. These are pieces I got a little while ago. <laughs> they aren't of me, but they are of my videos. <laughs> the person who emailed this to me signed his name as Lyndon B. Johnson, like the American president. Uh, I don't... I don't think it's actually Lyndon B. Johnson, but I don't think people usually lie on the internet. Uh, <laughs> he's got a Giga Chad beat and Proto Man ex explaining Amogus to Mega Man. Incredible stuff. <laughs> Maybe it is the real Lyndon B. Ah! Ramen Bits became a Mega Chad. Thank you so much, Ramen Bits. If you guys don't know Ramen Bits, uh, she's also a streamer. She streams on Twitch if you want to go check her out. Uh, she makes really nice art, some pixel art and stuff too. So uh, yeah, give her a follow if you want more content. She's also a big Mega Man fan. So uh, yeah, check her out if you're looking for more streamers to watch. da -da! Okay, that's it for the fan art. Now for the official art, I gotta give a big shout out. Just a quick thank you to my channel artists. Everything you see on the channel on screen right now is done by me. All the pixel art's done by- Oh, Flame Stripe! Thank you. Welcome to the Mega Chads, bro. Thank you so much for the support. So all the pixel art is done by me, except for the channel emotes, which we'll get to in a second. But whenever you see traditional art, Check the description because I cannot draw. I draw the thumbnails in MS Paint, but I can't do other. So in my first video, the original doctor background and sketch was done by Bitternut Hickory. He's a good friend of mine over on ArtStation. Uh, he 
he did the original background and oh. LML123! Welcome to the Mega Chads, man! Oh, nice icon. Luigi. Ramen Bits Super Chatted $5. Thank you for the small shout out. I really appreciate it. Oh, thank you, Ramen. No, you, you deserve it. I, I really like your content. I, I can't make it to streams very often, but whenever I see art by you on Twitter, it always brightens up my day. So thank you. Um, so yeah, Bitter Nut Hickory did the original. This is the original without any overlays. You see, you see the blue screen right here? That's how it looks originally uh, before I put my like webcam and stuff on it. And then of course, if you guys haven't seen my lore video yet that dropped earlier this morning, that was done by Mellow.jpg. Um, he drew the scientist, Doc, and he drew the entire comic for the lore video. So just a huge shout out to him, a huge thanks. Uh, without him, you know, a lot of my ambitious projects would not be possible. And, you know, another really close friend of mine and um yeah thank you so much i love you guys i uh thanks <laughs> i uh, you can see you you can expect more art from them in the future and if you haven't seen the lore video go check it out after the stream or during a break or something it's only three minutes long and it's it's pretty freaking cool in my opinion is doc short for doctor yeah yeah yeah, I think. Yeah, his name's Doctor Something. I I don't know. I I I just call him Doc. It's easier. I don't remember his name, but whatever. This is, is Doc. And that's the end. Uh, oh wait, no, there's one more. Special thanks for my emotes. My emotes are done by Azure Gemabyte on Twitter. Amazing pixel artist. She does really really good work. Super fun to work with too. You know, she's, she listens to, you know, what I wanted and she took what I wanted and amplified it, uh, 20 fold and just made it look so crazy good. And, um, yeah, this is, those are my emotes. I'm probably going to commission more emotes from her in the future. So once we unlock, I think we probably unlocked some slots today. We got, a, we got a lot of mega chads in here. Um, so I'm going to have to commission her again. And uh, yeah, they they turn out awesome. So yeah, thank you so much. And that's the end of the special thanks. So now we're going to do, I see a lot of questions in chat. Uh, uh, sorry, I've skipped over most of them. I've been leading up to this or trying to at least. We're going to try out YouTube's Q&A feature. Give me just one second to activate the Q&A. Uh, a bit of a start a Q and A. Q and A exclamation point. Start Q and A. So I don't know how this works. I've never done it before, but you guys can potentially write questions here and. Uh, I'll be able to, to read them. Okay. Give me one second to switch back to the right slide here. Okay. We're getting some, we're getting some Q's and we're getting some, and we're going to be getting some A's. Oh, wow. That's a lot of Q's. <laughs> I'll try to, I'll try to answer as many as I can. Uh, we'll probably just do Q and A for like, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, and then we'll play some freaking video games. Uh, but yeah, so, um, can't see the top question. Hold on one second. What's that say? Bro, YouTube, you're covering my top question. Uh, okay. I think the top question was favorite game of all time. I remember seeing it pop up very first.
Uh, is there any way I can show these questions on the stream? Give me one second. I think I can. I just want to make sure that I'm not showing too much information. Do I have any sensitive information on this screen? I don't think I do. Hmm. Oh, I know what I can do. One second. So we're going to kind of run it like this. A window capture. Check it out. We got a snipping tool of all the, of, of the questions and I'll, I'll make another one once we get more. Okay. So the first question, which I can't get in the snipping tool for some reason is what is your favorite game of all time? God damn it. That's such a hard question to answer. Uh, Favorite game of all time. I think the game that had most impact on my life so far is Mega Man X4. Um, aside from MMOs, uh, I don't really want to mention MMOs because I don't want to like <laughs> dox myself too hard. I, I met all my friends on, on MMO games, but... Um, uh, as far as favorite game of all time, Mega Man X4. Uh, how can we send fan art to you? Also, check out Juice Galaxy and Pizza Tower. Pizza Tower looks sick. I'll definitely play that at some point. Uh, you can send fan art to me either through the email. If you go to the About page on YouTube, you can find my business email. I also take fan art there. I don't mind getting fan art in my email. Or you can tag me on Twitter. I'm thinking of starting an art tag on Twitter. A lot of VTubers do that. So if you use Twitter, I know a handful of you guys don't, and I don't blame you. Uh, email it to me or check Twitter and check the uh, the art tag once that gets posted. But otherwise, just at me. I'll, I'll retweet it as well. So thank you so much for your question, Brian Curie. Davey5000, do you think X7 is better than X6? No, I don't. I like X6 better than X7 for sure. Uh, it's it's no contest for me. Uh, I like what X7 tried to do, but I'm not really a big fan of 2.5D games in general. And then the 3D just kind of fell flat. I never played X8 though. I've never played X8. I heard I hear they fixed a lot of issues and made a much better game at that point. Uh, but yeah, I, I actually do like X6 unironically. I don't think it's a terrible game. I think it's pretty hard and I think it's weirdly balanced, but I think it's okay. Do you have any gaming collabs planned? Not yet. No, I, I don't have any collabs planned right now, but I'm I'm looking forward to doing some at some point. What are you going to do once you get a body? Uh, uh I don't... What do you do when you get a body? Uh, I guess I'll probably like play some video games or something. I don't know. As maybe I'll I'll touch grass. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, I'll I'll touch some grass. Yeah, let's. Yeah, yeah. The first thing I'll do when I get a body is I'll touch some grass. Crunchster, do you like pineapples on your pizza? It's one of my mods asking me if I like pineapples on my pizza. Yeah, I don't I don't mind pineapples on pizza. Uh there's a time and a place for it. Don't fry me if you're a pineapple hater. I like I, I think it's okay. Uh, I don't like canned pineapple. On pizza, I think there's there's a good way to do it. And a good listen, if you if you take a, a freaking DiGiorno pizza and you dump a can of pineapple on, of course it's gonna be bad, okay? But if you take like fresh pineapple and you put it on pizza and you let it, when when the oven cooks it, it kind of dries it a little bit, and it makes it nice and sweet. There's not there's not pineapple juice spraying all over the place. That's good. That's good stuff. I don't like 
cafeteria pineapple pizza, but I do think pineapple on pizza is okay. What's the dog's name? It's Murph, M-E-R-F. I, I showed this little, uh, I showed this little letter that came with him earlier. When he appeared two weeks ago, this letter popped up next to him. Murph, please take care of him. He has anxiety. Poor little guy. I promise I'll save him. I don't really know what that means. I mean, I already say like he's living with me, so he's safe. Uh, maybe this that just means he's a rescue. I, I don't know. Uh, no idea. But yeah, his name's Murph. Sweet little dog. He's my son. He's my baby. And I am his father now. So yeah. Will you play Mega Man Soccer? Yes, I will. How did you start your YouTube channel without access to the internet? That's a really good question. You know, a lot of people are like, hey man, so you can, you can access the internet, but you can't move to like, just like a better computer. You can't just, uh, I, I, I can't access the internet. Me, personally, I can't do it but sometimes when i want something really bad it just happens so when i woke up on august 1st and the doc was like hey go play mega man i was like okay but i really want to make a youtube video on it and uh, i didn't tell him that but I just did it. And then I tried to post it. And I was like, wait a minute, I'm not connected to the internet. What the hell? But eventually, you know, I tried to figure it out. I was like, how do I get connected? How do I connect to the internet? I, I don't have an ethernet cable. There's no ethernet cable. There wasn't an ethernet cable connected to the PC or anything. It just happened. The couple is, you know, I don't know. I, I wish I could tell you. I don't know. There are strange forces at work here that I just, I don't, I don't know how it works. It just works. If you're a JoJo fan like me, sometimes you understand things just work. So my answer to your question, uh, I didn't. It just happened. What breed is Murph? I think he's a Chihuahua mix? The Chihuahua something. Look at his little Chihuahua face. His little Chihuahua ears. But he's bigger than the average Chihuahua. He's like, uh... Maybe like a... Like a Jack Russell or something? He's got long legs. He might be part Greyhound. I don't know. I have to do like a... <laughs> a 23 and me, but for my dog at some point. What is your favorite classic Mega Man game? Uh, Mega Man 8. That's my favorite classic Mega Man game. Much like Mega Man X4, same era. I played both of them a ton. Mega Man 8's my favorite. My favorite NES game is probably 4. Will you make a Guts Man meme for every Mega Man video? Well, if I'm being honest, probably not. I think you guys can expect a Gutsman meme as long as I can find a way to make a funny one. If you guys watched my Mega Man 6 video, I, I somehow managed to make Centaur Man's ass pop out as the Gutsman meme. And it doesn't really, like, let's say I'm sitting down with you in a room and I'm like, and you're like, hey, what's the Gutsman meme for Mega Man 6? I'm like, well, what about Centaur Man showing you his ass? You'd probably sit there and be like, that's stupid. That doesn't make any sense. I think the meme turned out okay. But in the future, if I can't figure out a good way to do it, I'll probably just not do it. Just like the you got sections. I try to do a you got section for every video. But as you guys know, in a couple of videos, I couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it. I just couldn't think of funny ones. I couldn't. I just couldn't think of anything. Uh, maybe in the future, as far as you gots go, I'll do like viewer submitted ones. That might be fun. Like a you got contest. Like we get to Mega Man 9. I'm like, hey, make a funny meme about a, th this guy, the Splash Woman's weapon. 
and then I'll take the best ones and I'll put it in the video. So yeah, will I do a Guts Man meme for every video? Uh, probably not. How do you get new games in the old PC? Well, my old PC is connected with lots of cables and wires to a new PC and a couple of new hardware pieces. So essentially, I'm on a very old PC that I live inside, but that one's basically on life support connected to a bunch of other PCs. So, uh, yeah, I, I live in an old PC, but I have a new PC that I'm connected to. You can drink E-Tanks? Uh, can I drink an E-Tank? I don't, I don't think E-Tanks are real. I, I don't really drink energy drinks in general. I don't, I, a couple of months ago, I actually quit caffeine. I I didn't like how it made me feel anxious and jittery. I still drink coffee, but just decaf coffee. Um, and since I quit caffeine, I felt a lot better. Uh, and, uh, yeah, <laughs> you got no bitches. <laughs> That's a good one, Alyssa J, 1988. That's funny. <laughs> RA command. Uh, could you physically defeat Airman? Could I be Airman? Like, me. Like, with my fists. Uh... No. I don't think so. I think he beat the shit out of me. I try to punch him and get my arm caught in his, in his fan. I've also never tried to punch anyone, so I, I don't know how that even works. I'm not really a fighter. I'm a lover, not a fighter. <laughs> oh, Murph. I pressed the wrong hotkey. I'm a lover, not a fighter, baby. <laughs> I'd rather... I'd rather go out to dinner with Airman than try and beat him up. But yeah, he'd, he'd, he'd kick my ass. No doubt about it. Let's do a couple more questions. I do want to try and play some video games today. But we'll do maybe one more line of questions. Let's see. Let's see, is that showing up? Let me see my new snip. Aha, my new snip. Any tips for pixel artists trying to animate? Asking for a friend. Well, my animation journey started a long time ago when I was in about, uh, fifth grade. My parents got me Flash 8, so I made stick figure animations and they were never very good, but it ended up being kind of the foundation for learning how to animate at least. And, uh, and, um, as far as tips for trying to animate as a pixel artist, I would start by going on a website that does sprite sheets and just looking at the ways other sprites animate. So like a reference I try to use a lot is Shovel Knight. I think their art style is something that I really, I, it's, it's something that inspires me a lot. Like, and the way they move around and stuff is very cool. And of course I'm also inspired by Mega Man. I mean, that's kind of obvious. And the way they move their characters, uh, is something I try to emulate. There's a lot of like, YouTubers I watch too, or I watch whenever I'm trying to get into animating or like start a new project. I, I do some research first. And like I said, I'm still pretty new to it. So I try and get as much uh, input as I can from different sources. And I try different things. There's lots of rules that pixel art tries to uh, conform to. You know, like no jaggies, stuff like that. Uh, I don't want, I'm not going to get into it too much right now. Um, but, um, it's, uh, 
you have to think of those rules and play with them and figure out a way that they work to what you're trying to animate. And then start small, okay? Start with a walk cycle. Start with, you know, maybe just an attack animation or something. Attack animations are really fun. They're usually only like three or four frames. You got the the wind up. And then usually for pixel art, when you like, let's say you're swinging a sword, usually the swing is just one frame and it's smeared. That's kind of something I really like about pixel art is their emphasis on single frame actions with smearing. Something I've, I I like. So, um, yeah, those, those are my tips. Sorry. I, 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 I wish I thought about that question in the past, like how I would answer it. I'll try and think of some better tips for the next time someone asks me about pixel art. Music? You do it or do you like anything? Any albums? Um, me and music have a weird relationship. Uh, throughout my life, and this is me speaking 100% honestly, like, don't make fun of me. My favorite tracks were always like video game music. I love listening to just video game OSTs, instrumental stuff. And then usually when I'm looking for like non video game music, I'll turn to, well, kind of what you're listening to right now. This is a, I'm not even sure what you would call this. This song is called Tanuki by Shimmer City. It's one of Riot's uh, creator safe songs. So I'm not going to get DMCA'd for playing this, but this is kind of the genre that I really like. Sort of like, like Daft Punk, uh, techno synthesizer type stuff. I really like chiptune music. I love that futuristic. Uh, I also like lo-fi. Um, and yeah, that's kind of everything I like. I don't listen to a lot of like current music though, unless it's on the radio when I'm like driving somewhere. Favorite dinosaur, uh, a raptor, a raptor, a raptor. Good question. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't think I need to really explain any further. Raptors are cool, you know? Imagine a giant chicken Basically, that's gonna <laughs> kill you with its claws. And, you know, in Jurassic Park, they hunt in packs. I don't know if that's true. I'm, I'm guessing they did their research. What's your favorite anime? Oh, brother. My favorite anime series. I have a couple of answers to this. My favorite anime series is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, I love it. A lot. I make that pretty clear in a lot of my videos. Um, my favorite 90s anime is Berserk. I love Berserk. Uh, I feel like Berserk resonates with me in a special place. Uh, in a way that Jojo doesn't. Like, they're both my favorites for different reasons. Berserk is sick. If you've never seen Berserk, you should give it a watch. Uh, content warming, content warning. There is some pretty heavy stuff in Berserk, but um, so do some research before you watch it. I don't want to, you know, recommend something that will potentially freak anyone out or anything. But it is a really good anime, and uh, Berserk is sick. My favorite manga is this is my favorite manga. I think it's also Berserk. <laughs> Maybe the answer to this question is my favorite anime is JoJo. My favorite manga is Berserk. Uh, not the 2018 anime Berserk. I don't watch that. I haven't. I haven't seen it. I'm looking forward to the remastered version. Did you guys see any Berserk fans? You saw uh, they're making uh, they're making a, the Golden Age. They're like uh, 
remaking it from the movies like a director's cut type thing. I'm gonna watch that. That's gonna be sick. What's your favorite Mega Man game in the classic series? Mega Man 8. Uh, you might have missed this earlier, but aside from making money for Doc, why are you tasked with playing games? As far as I know, that's the only reason. Uh, I will say, whenever I beat a game, I do feel pretty good. You know, when you beat a game, there's like a sense of triumph, right? It's a nice feeling, like, yeah, I did it. We we got there. But for me, it's 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 a little more than that on a physical level that I don't think I can explain without getting weird. Um, but yeah, uh, it's mostly just so Doc can do his research. How do you come up with the jokes, funny stuff in your videos? Wow. That's a really tough question to answer. Uh, because it kind of dives into the essence of comedy, right? Uh, being funny is a skill. And it's something you have to- oh! Lucifroggy Boostio Super Chatted $3. Have you seen a Uhaku show? Luci <laughs> Lucifroggy Boostio. He's, he's one of the other members that joined before the stream. Uh, so thank you so much. Have I seen Yu Yu Hakusho? Yes, I've watched all of it. It's another one of my favorite animes. It's it's up there in like the top five. <laughs> good uh, good good call there. You've got good taste. That game is uh, not game. That anime is sick. I love it a lot. <laughs> I <laughs> hold on a second. I used to do a really good impression of some of the characters from the anime. If if my if my throat will let me, let me let me give it a try. Uh, okay. Kuwabara? No, that's that's not right. I don't know. You're a meshi. What the hell are you doing over there with your spirit gun? I'm going to kick your ass, you're a meshi, cuz I got a sword. <laughs> I can't do a very good Yusuke right now, but the Kuwabara voice, I think, is pretty good. <laughs> uh, so how do I come up with the jokes? Well, as you go through life and you absorb content, it slowly molds your sense of humor, right? If you look at a lot of comedy and you look at a lot of original works and stuff, it makes you better at being funny yourself. And then, of course, you have to try and be funny and, you know, tell jokes to your friends and see what makes them laugh, see what doesn't. And so over the course of my life, I've done that a lot. I've I've tried to make people laugh a lot. It's kind of the one skill that I've... Oh! School for Super Shattered $1.99. Thanks for the cents. two. If you like Vinland the Saga. Try Vinland Saga. Thank you so much for the two, Skelva. 8-Bit Mask, hey, remember me? Yeah, I've seen you on Twitter. Thank you for the fan art. Um, what was I saying? Funny, funny stuff. Um, and then once you've got funny jokes in your head, I sit down and I watch the gameplay and I try and write jokes for what's going on. And sometimes it's not even always a joke. Sometimes it's just, hey, uh, freaking... It's... <laughs> Some... That's why a lot of my video is also just review. Because I don't like any dead air in the video, of course. But between each joke, if I can't think of a joke, I just talk about whatever. And sometimes I talk about it with a funny inflection. Or I talk about it in a way that's different from like the regular review and you know i try to be funny and I'm, I'm glad a lot of you guys think i'm funny and you know if you're trying to get into comedy if you're trying to get into making funny videos on the internet just understand that before you can be funny there's a lot of there's a lot of unfunny you have to get through i i I try to use the word cringe rarely 
recently I've tried to stop using that word too much because I feel like calling something cringe sucks. It sucks. It takes the air out of things. And I think sometimes I am cringe and that's something I have to accept. You gotta be cringe before being funny. Dan Turn the Lola put Super it perfectly. $20. Thank you. Oh! What the? Philip Collette with 20? Thank you so much! Oh, that's a cute sticker. YouTube's got some cute stickers, huh? It's a lot of trial and error, like Karin Pinyan said. And, uh... Basically, the way I like to think of it... Wacky Snack is super shatted one dollar and ninety nine cents. It would be funny if you went to Brazil. Wacky Snacky with the two. You are going to Brazil. I'd love to go to Brazil. Unironically, uh, I'd love to check it out at some point. So a way I like to think about cringe versus funny. If you've ever played a competitive game, like Overwatch or League of Legends, Dota. Any uh, Apex Legends, any game that has a kill death assist ratio, your KDA. You got your kills, you got your deaths, you got your assists. Okay? Lucifer Froggy Boostio Super Shatted $10. You're goated for that Kua Bar impression. Take my money, guy. <laughs> Thank you so much, Lucifer Froggy. I, I did my best. So you've got a KDA, right? Thank you so much for the 10. You got a KDA, right? In those games. In real life, you have a funny cringe chuckle ratio, okay? Sometimes you tell a joke and it's really funny. And you get one point to your funny. Sometimes you tell a joke and it's cringe. Or you do something that's cringe. That's your death ratio, okay? And if you tell a joke or you play off of someone else's joke, that's your, your chuckle. That's your... Breathe a little bit of no air out your nose. Dollars. Type. Love the cringe when you get old like me. You learn to love it, but you are not cringe. You Aww, sweet. Thank you, gay statue. I appreciate it. Yeah, you have to learn to love the cringe because think about it. In games that have a KDA, usually there's a big difference between someone that goes one kill, zero death, zero assists. They're not, con they're not contributing. They're not even playing the game at that point. They're like AFK farming minions or something. Versus the person that goes 12 kills, 4 deaths, 16 assists. Yeah, they got 4 deaths. They made 4 cringe jokes. But you have to make those cringe jokes in order to find the funny ones. So yeah, you've got a KDA IRL. You've got a KDA IRL. And it's your your funny cringe haha. -ha, your funny cringe chuckle ratio. That's the way I like to think of it. So if you're trying to be funny, if you're trying to get good at comedy, you have to make jokes and you have to, you know, make some unfunny jokes because you'll never know what's unfunny unless someone tells you un you're unfunny. And of course, I uh <laughs> I've told plenty of unfunny jokes and plenty of people have told me that. So yeah. I appreciate you guys that say I'm funny in the chat and in the comments. I really do appreciate it. Um, Dalzo, thank you, Daizo, thank you for the question. Yeah, I, I, I'm i glad my explanation resonated with you. Um, but yeah, that's, that's kind of how you got to do it. If you want to try and get funnier. Tonk, are you real? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, I think so. Uh, okay, we're getting existential. I, I'm I'm gonna move on to the next question. What consoles do you have? I have I'm a PC gamer. I do most of my gaming on PC. I have a PS4, and I have a Nintendo Switch. Uh, and yeah, those are I have a 3DS too. I think. Laying around somewhere. They are all in my, uh, laying around in the office somewhere. Doc's office. Are you going to play the Mega Man Limelight games or heck even the Minus game? I don't know what those are. I'm sorry. 
guess I could look it up really quick. Mega Man Limelight. Oh, by Minus D and Minus Infinity? Because I'll definitely be playing Minus Infinity. Oh, Limelight! You play as the Robot Masters. Heck yeah, I'll play this at some point. That's sick. Yeah, I'll play that. Fuck it. <laughs> that looks awesome. I'll play it eventually for sure. How do I put art? Uh, You can either email it to me, go to my about section and find my business email. You can email me art there or you can tag me on Twitter. Will you play in limited? Uh, yeah. Have you seen the Japanese pre-order for Battle Network? I haven't seen the Japanese one. I saw the English one. Uh, yeah. And this, I think, is the last question I'm going to take formally right now. Of course, I'll still answer questions in the chat later while I'm I'm hanging out with you guys. But um, have you played any Kirby games? Or at least played and beaten Kirby in the Forgotten Land? I've never played... I haven't played the newest Kirby game, no. But I have played many a Kirby game. I've played 64, Crystal Shards. I've played... Uh, I got... Uh, Kirby Superstar from Blockbuster as a kid and after we returned it I cried so much that <laughs> my mom went back and bought it. <laughs> uh, I love Kirby. It's it's a really, really great genre. It's very close to my heart as well. Um, so yeah, Kirby 64 goaded. It is. Can you check my art on Twitter please? Uh, I will, I'll, I'll check after the stream for sure. I want to kind of move things along into some gameplay. What do you animate with? I animate with Asaprite, the sprite program, and I usually just convert them into GIFs, GIFs, and I upload them into my video editor, which is Vegas Pro. But Forgotten Land is Pete Kirby IMO. I know, it looks amazing, I just haven't gotten around to playing it. Hi right, guy, it's me, Abe Star Gaming. Hi, Abe Star Gaming. Kirby Epic Yarn is the most <laughs> relaxing game ever made. Yeah, that's that is true. I love that game a lot. Do you like Chainsaw Man? I do like Chainsaw Man. Okay, let's move on from these questions. Thank you so much for all the questions. I'll have to do like another Q and A in the future at some point. Um. But I'm kind of, I mean, I've been sitting here talking for almost two and a half hours. I, I'm kind of running out of steam there. So I'm going to move on to the next part of our stream. So uh, I have to, <laughs> I have to put this slide at the end of my, uh, my so Google Slides extravaganza $2. so Yo I don't guy, get can you sued. Help out with my calculus homework? <laughs> Thank you for the two, Octo. No, I can't. I am... Not very good at math. I'm more of a more of an English person. Uh, thanks, slides go for the fucking template. Whatever. Okay. So now we're gonna move on to the next part of the stream. Uh, if you guys read the description, you saw I'm gonna be playing the Game Boy games next. So uh, let's do it. Let's freaking start. Now, uh, uh, let me go ahead and plug this HDMI cable into my Game Boy. How do you, how do you fit this freaking thing? LML 123 it's not Super Shattered $3. Have you played any Bomberman? Oh, Sorry I for question. Oh, thank you for three dollars. No, feel free to answer, ask questions. I, I'll try and answer as many as I see in the chat. But um, uh, I I have played some Bomberman. I played uh, I had it on the Wii Virtual Console at some point, and um, you know, I played the PvP version with friends. I guess it's all PvP in the first one anyway. But uh, yeah, I've played Bomberman. The game's great. Okay, I think I got my Game Boy working. Give me one second. Can you hear it? Can you hear the the sultry tones of my Oh it cut out. The sultry tones of my Game Boy rocking out? Okay, now let me see if I can show it to you. 
It's not showing up. One second. Please. There it is. Yeah, we got our HDMI cable plugged into our freaking, uh, our, our, our Game Boy. And now we can play the Game Boy game. So, freaking, thank you guys for coming to my stream, basically, and hanging out with me for two hours while I talk to you and we get to know each other. But now, it's time for some freaking video games! Let's go! Okay, like I said, I've, I've never played... I... I think I've played the Game Boy games, at least some of them, but I must have been like two or three or whatever when I played them. I have no recollection of this game or how it works or like, what the heck. I did a little bit of research. You see, this game came out in 1991, which is after Mega Man 4? Or like right around when Mega Man 4 came out? Something like that? Correct me if I'm wrong. 100% not pirated, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, this, I've got my HDMI cable plugged into my Game Boy. That's how we're, that, that's, that's how it's, how else would I be streaming this game? Uh, thanks a lot, I have food poisoning. I'm so sorry. Hope you feel better watching the stream. Hey, Power, you have Brazilian subscribers like me and others. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Hello, my Brazilian friend. Can't slide. Okay. So, yeah, we're gonna... This came out a few months before Mega Man 4. Okay, thank you. Thank you for correcting me. It came out after Mega Man 3. So... Let's go ahead and start. I really don't know what to expect. So, I mean, this is all normal, but, of course, there's a very thick Robot Master that is missing. Well, let me end the Q&A. Is that something I can do? Because I think it's still running, and... Okay. We're good. Now we just got regular chat. This game only takes things from Mega Man 1 and 2. Yeah, I hear there's eight bosses. Someone said you should start with Cutman 100%. Should I start with Cutman? You guys think I should? I mean, it's pretty... Yeah, it's pretty standard. I, let's do it. Let's let's start with Cutman. Oh god, I haven't played Mega Man in like in a couple weeks, so... Give me a second. Gotta make sure my setup is... Decent. Whoa, that music is sick, actually. Yeah, something I do know about the Game Boy games is their music is pretty interesting. Oh, this this is like a remixed version of Cutman? Bro, die. Oh, God. It's kind of floaty. Like, I... Your, ah! Your velocity kind of carries as you're jumping and stuff. Eee. <gasps> a free dude! Ah, fuck! Do I have Rush Coil? Nope. Uh, so they expect me to run all the- Yeah, I'll do it. Let's go get that one up, baby. Ah! Oh, those things are tanky. Ah, oh, fucking- Damn it. Like someone said earlier, I can't slide. What is that noise? Is that the, the buzzsaw revving up? It sounded like Kirby sucking. Okay, we got it. Yeah, let's go. Don't shoot me. Please. Ah, fuck. Yeah, why is Kirby sucking in the background? Ah! Oh, God. <laughs> ah! I can't mash fast enough to kill that thing before it hits me. Oh, my fuck. You ever just die in Cutman stage? Oh, so that is the sound of the buzz saw. Okay. We got our bearings. We're figuring out how to play on a Game Boy. It is, ah, it is a little bit different than NES titles. It's for sure. <laughs> okay, gotta get back to where we started. 
another fucking Roomba, a buzzsaw. Okay. There's a lot more things that can cut you in this level, I notice, versus the NES counterpart. Buzzsaws and spiky Roombas. And it's interesting that they incorporated... Why aren't you moving? What? I did not just do that. Come on, man. I promise I play video games. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> it's just I don't know how to ex how to describe it. The when you're jumping, it like carries a lot of your velocity forward. So like I'll jump and I'll I'll tap left or right and it'll kind of keep going where in the NES games, you only go as long as you're holding left or right. It's going to take a bit to get used to. I'm not coping. <laughs> I'm not bad at Fuck me! <laughs> Power guy can't beat Mega Man World colorized. Okay, so is this guy just not gonna go? Yeah, I guess not. Or maybe the... Th the idea is he, he was going, but... Oh, come on. He can't do it! He can't beat Mega Man colorized! He can't beat Mega Man World! We've just got zero lives. I should probably just kill myself. This is too much. Okay, d give it to me straight, chat. Is this one of the harder games? Or am I turbo cringe? Is this one of the harder games or am I bad? I think it's hard. This game is so hard. Okay. You are turbo cringe. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Okay. This time, full serious. Ah! You know, my goal was to beat this game today so that we do the do the second one tomorrow. But things are looking a little sussy. I might actually have to get out a <laughs> a piece of scratch paper and write down a a fucking password. <laughs> we play it tomorrow. No, we're gonna beat it today. I got a good, uh, I got a good amount of energy left. I got some, I got a Nutrigain bar here if I, if I get hungry. <laughs> ah, this jump sucks ass. Can I make the Roomba despawn? Nope, they, they thought of that. Okay. Hooey! Okay, not too bad. Oh, fuck you. Ah, this is fucked. Oh god. Ooh, no, fuck me. Ah, I should have just went for it. I, yeah, I mean, yeah. it's fine. We're fine. You can't spell gamer without. Urr. I'm fucking smadge right now. God, this spacing sucks so much. It's so weird. It's also weird being having the screen this small. Usually you got a lot more space to work with. But I promise by the end of this week, I'm gonna be a Game Boy God Gamer. I'm gonna be a game man at the end of this week. Smadge, what the fuck is that? Oh, don't worry about it. It's just a. I, yeah, I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> we might need to go back to the Q&A, boys. <laughs> That's content I can really get behind. That's something I can... Start with Cutman, they said. It'll be fun, they said. If this is the easy one... What the hell am I gonna do when I get to... To Alec Man? Okay, I got boosted. Oh, fuck. I somehow beat Mega Man 1 through 4 in the same week. That's what I'm trying to do. Fuck. This is so mean. 
That section is so mean. And then this guy doesn't move, which is pretty toxic. Can't get that. Do you get Rush Coil? I'm assuming you do, since it's after Mega Man 3. They implemented Rush. Also, I have zero lives, I'm noticing. Uh, it's fine. Oh, my f Uh, Gotta snipe this guy. <laughs> Christ. Ooh, I'm sick with it. I got the footwork. <laughs> oh, wait. Ah, fuck me. Ah, damn it. Ah. Ah. Okay, I can kind of hit him without him being able to hit me, I think. Yeah, get fried, idiot. Yeah! Sniper Joe? Oh god. What the hell? What is half- Stop! No, not with the conveyor belt, dude. <laughs> you should install pain receptors on the power guy so he will feel the pain Mega Man feels every time he gets hit and dies. I think that's a bad idea! <laughs> Probably, I'd probably die myself right now. Okay. Looks like you got cut off. Thanks, Orknestra. I'm gonna take a bite of this energy bar. Give me some energy. Okay. Bait the roly boy. Those guys take like four freaking shots to kill. It's absurd. Ah, oh, damn it. Spacing so weird. Ah! Let's go get that one up. Oh, come down. Nah, we're not getting the one up. Fuck it. <laughs> I'm done. We're fine with two. It's fine. It's not fucking. Fuck it. Easy? Easy peasy? Gotta boobop this guy? And time for the worst jump in the entire franchise, I think? Hey! <laughs> Okay, nice. Of course, that space to hit me perfect. Fucking. I might need to have a word with fucking KG and Afune after this one. The way he designed all of the platforms to. <laughs> all of the platforms to be exactly where the, the turrets shoot you. A lot of this level is just tricky conveyor belts over bottomless pits. Yeah! I'm really hoping there's a... Checkpoint. I don't know if they do those in the Game Boy games. Let's go! I've got one health! Plenty! Oh god. This fucking guy. Okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to- okay. Oh hell no! What the f- Why? It's gonna send me back- Oh, it's gonna be here! Okay! It's playable! It's- 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 it's playable. Got a chance. Fuck. Oh, he, he boosted me? It's fine. Yeet! No, no! It's not playable. It's unwinnable. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> I let you down. <laughs> I... <laughs> I can't believe this shit, man. They really did me so astronomically dirty. Okay, I can... Up. And of course, you don't move, do you? Yeah, I, I know your tricks. Oh, that's the end here. Oh, no! 
There's no way in hell I kill this guy. Okay, he did a long jump. Thank goodness. Ah, there's more. Oh, this would be like Cutman's level in the NES. This is like twice as long as the NES Cutman. Le Fuck! Fuck! Oh, the jumps are so weird on Game Boy. Okay. Mama didn't raise no quitter, boys. We're in here. Will this stream be archived? Yeah. You'll be able to watch it whenever the hell you want. If you want to watch me suffer, uh, it'll just be in the live section of my channel. Ooh. Okay, we're doing a no-hit run now. Fuck! Just kidding. Uh, that was that was a joke. That was a well-timed joke. <laughs> Sheesh! Just hope the chat won't be erased from the VOD. I have a uh, live chat enabled, so you should be able to see it in the VOD. It's just something you have to toggle on. I'm pretty sure. Uh, YouTube streaming is. No, please stop. YouTube streaming is a little bit weird. It's got some quirks, but I think I figured it out. Uh, versus Twitch streaming, at least. Mega Man and Base has nothing on this game. For real? Is this game really that hard? What did I get myself into? I was I was literally sitting here yesterday, like. Man, I'm planning to stream for like three or four hours. I, I gotta make sure I got content for three or four hours. So I'm gonna do like a fucking, I'm gonna do a PowerPoint. That'll be fun, I'll take Q&A. We'll do lots of cool stuff. And uh, then I'll, I'll beat Mega Man 1 and 2 on the game. They'll probably only take like an hour max. But here I am at the same jump for the last 20 minutes. This Roomba's just watching me. Okay, it's easy. Hey! Easy. And then this guy is fucking cringe. Okay. Yeah, no, I... <laughs> the way they set up that screen is so toxic. They don't make them like they used to, boys. What do you guys think is harder? This game or Dark Souls... Uh... Name your Dark Souls. Dark Souls 1. This game or Dark Souls 1? Which is harder? Oh. Heiko says this game. Star Wilder says this. Cope. Some <laughs> yeah, I'm coping a little bit. I have to. This is where I am right now. I'm in Cutman stage on the goddamn Game Boy. I thought, I thought I'd be done by now. I thought I'd be hanging out with Gutsman by now. I thought I'd have killed Wily by now. Got another big guy for you. Does he do any sh Oh, he does do short hops. You're a bastard. Fuck! Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay. Do I have any E-Tanks? Of course not. Why, why, why would I cope that hard? Ah, fuck. There's another scissor down here. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, ah! time for sure. Easy. I got boosted. He gave me a little bit of health back. We're chilling. Mega Man 1 Game Boy has no E-Tanks. Oh Christ, I'm fucked. Wait, ah! ah. I was looking at chat. I thought I went down the screen. I need you to do a long hop. Fuck! It's kind of just RNG there, huh? Like, 
how would I avoid- Is there a way to one cycle the big eye if I've got like crazy good aim? Maybe. Oh hell no, you're so cringe. Ah! Why? <laughs> Only got one- Surely cut man's like just down the side. You're fucking with me! Alexander uh, Tirado super chatted five dollars. <laughs> Guy, I absolutely love your work and can't wait to see more. You can do it. Fight for everlasting peace. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Alexander Tirado. Ah, where'd my game go? Wait. I'll fight! I'll fight for everlasting peace! I'm gonna fuck you up, cut man! Is he still weak to my gun? Oh no, he's eating it up. Oh god. Okay. Ah! <laughs> no. He doesn't seem like his patterns are too hard, though. The trick is to run with confidence. Yes, Davy5000. I need to. Thank you. I need to have more confidence. Okay, this is the run, boys. And And once you beat one level in Mega Man, the rest of the game opens up. That's just- that's just how it is. So we beat this level, and suddenly, it's like we've beaten the whole game, anyway. So... I really wouldn't worry about it too much. Fuck, I jumped into that one. I thought I'd need to do, like, a short one. Okay. This part's easy. No, it's not. I fucked it up. Fucked up the sequence. Now I'm gonna get hit twice. I got hit once. Okay, it's fine. More buzzsaw boys. Sound effect is so good, but it does really sound like Kirby sucking. Ah, the spacing on that is horrendous. I'm safe here. Oh, he doesn't shoot when I'm there. Cringe. Okay. No, I'm supposed to be safe there. Ah, please. Someone save me. Okay, the checkpoint. The checkpoint's on the next screen, but I'll never see it. Okay. Try and focus up a little bit here. Can't just get fried by Cutman's level for the entire rest of the stream. I won't allow it. Okay, maybe I don't have a. I don't really have a choice in the matter sometimes. There is no saving you. You are playing Mega Man World. Zawardo! Get the one up, someone says. Yeah, I probably should have just like... You're fucking kidding. Okay. Did I say this run? Man, is Murph a DLC of your life? Uh, technically. Yeah, I think you could call it that. Okay, I'm gonna kill myself. I'm gonna get the one up. I'm gonna... I'm gonna unalive myself in the game. We're gonna restart. Maybe the answer really is just run with confidence, because I was, like, not getting hit much there. Please don't go up against Cutman without his weakness. It's nearly impossible without full health. Really? Everyone is saying start with Cutman! You need Mega Man G Fuel? Fuel? It's E tanks, but for humans? Also play Game Gear Mega Man. Yeah, I'll... I'll play whatever Mega Man game. That's pretty easy. Just run with confidence a little bit. Fuck. Okay. See, if I had more confidence, I would have been fine there. But I sort of... Under... Oh, it's fine! I'm RNG boosted. Now we're gonna get the one up. Compared to that other jump, this is super easy. So we just gotta kinda do a little... Fuck me. <laughs> super easy. We just gotta... Make the jump, forehead. How would you feel about- Super chatted one dollar and ninety-nine cents. How would you feel about fan-made stream highlights? Hey, thank you for the two. Ah, goddammit. I'm totally fine with that. 
if people want to clip the stream, I think there's like a button on YouTube nowadays where you can take content and clip it. If you guys want to make stream highlights, go for it. I would absolutely adore that. Think of how cool- fuck me! Think of how cool it would be for me, as a creator, to see, like, funny moments of myself on my homepage. I'd love that shit. Um, fuck. <laughs> I'm never gonna beat this- I'll never be a real boy at this rate. I'm fucked. But yeah, if you- if anybody wants to do that, feel free. Uh, just, you know. Put my name somewhere on it, just so people know where it's from. You're kidding me! There's no way I missed this one up four times in a row! Please! Someone! <laughs> I just beat Cutman! Well, good for you, corporation! I... <laughs> You're a real gamer. Why? Can I really go further on the conveyor belt than that? I got it once! Okay, this time for sure. Putting all of our eggs in this one run's basket. We're farming HP off of the Rolly Boys. No shot, dude. <laughs> that jump is so crazy. Please. Okay. I'm actually dumbfounded. Is my brain not working? It's. I, I'm doing- it's the definition of insanity! I'm doing the same thing over and over and over and expecting- E- Okay. So easy. First try. Fuck. The only thing that's shooting you, bro. No! <laughs> Sorry if this is painful to watch. But we'll get there. We're almost there. <laughs> Fuck! After all that work! You seriously can't write this stuff! This is... It's fine. We didn't need that one up. We only spent five minutes trying to get it. It's fucking fine! Who cares? I'm gonna hit by this. Okay, it's fine. It's whatever. No big deal. <laughs> Watch the room, but dodge the buzzsaw. Are you going to stream Mega Man Battle Network when the Legacy Collection comes out? Ah! I will, for sure. Capcom decided to buff Cut Man. Yeah, they really did, bro. His level is cringe. Well, his level's really cool, but holy crap, they made it hard. Whew. We enjoy being with you, not watching your gaming skills, silly. Well, I appreciate that. But I think there's only so much someone can take, you know? <laughs> Gengar guy. They say the definition of insanity is trying to say thing over and over respecting. Yeah. Yeah, that's where we're at right now. Okay, Roomba, move and then easy. And then I'm right in the line of fire for this guy, but it's, there's not like much I can do about it. Okay. It's okay, we're at the checkpoint. We're just about to be. Gotta snipe this little guy. Oh. I'm a goober. It's okay, we made it to the checkpoint. And then we've got one try to get there. And then we'll have probably maybe one full HP attempt on Cutman? At the end of this, you'll be able to do Cutman with your eyes closed. Yeah. This is the grind, baby. This is how games are supposed to be. Oh, damn it. <laughs> uh, oh, please just give me a long hop. Okay, nice. If we can somehow get to Cutman without getting hit. Oh, there's no shot, right? This part sucks so much. I have to do like a sh 
Do you like a short hop back past that scissors and then run in the circle? I'm just gonna wait until he figures out he can save state. That's fucking cheating! You can't- you- You think little Billy with his Game Boy in color could use game states? No! We're not doing that! We're not a game stater. Nothing wrong if you are a game stater, but we are not a game stater. We're doing this legit. Also, this is a real Game Boy that I have plugged in, so I can't do game states. Smile. Okay, sick. That was kind of clean. Fucking hell! I'm in hell! I'm in hell! I'm trapped! Lucifer Froggy Boostio Super Chatted $5. <laughs> Doc really said beat every game oh, during this game God. exists. SMH. Thanks for the five, Lucifer Froggy. I might be fucked! I might be absolutely fucked! Oh my god, thank you for the two, sure. Oh. And we said beat every game, I was like, yeah, fuck it, let's just. Sure, super shattered two just beat, ev just beat every game. Pepperonis. It's easy. Beat every game, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Do a long hop. Ah, damn it! No slide, no power shot. And they made Cutman this handsome? Oh Christ, and then there's this fucking dude. Oh, I'm a goober. Please. Oh, easy. Okay, we got a half HP attempt on Cutman. Easy. Did Doc recommend this? Well, he said I could play any game. I want to play this game. I want to beat this game. Think of how good it's going to feel when we finally beat this game. Okay. Oh, I jumped too early. Oh, he, he does other stuff too. Shit. Wait. Does it go... I think it goes all the way to the end of the screen. And then it comes back. That, that makes sense to me. Okay. How's the dog doing? He's good. He's just vibing. You might want to... You might want to get down off my lap at some point, probably. I don't know, he seems okay. I could really use the emotional support right now, so... I think it's probably fine. Ah, oh, Christ. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get the one up on our first try. If we don't get it, we're leaving. Alright. Here we go. Easy. Alright. Well, that sucks. Now nah, we're gonna give it one more try. I, I need it. I obviously need it. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I have to fight Cutman at full health. It's not playable unless I do. Okay. Easy. Christ. That was kind of clean. Woo. Sheesh. Gaming in the Clinton years. <laughs> That's funny as fuck. Oh my god. We really are gaming in the Clinton years. He that got you a dog. I is... Marvlo 7 super chatted two dollars. Doc got you a dog. Is Doc depressed? Is Doc depressed? Uh I don't know. Maybe a little bit. He's kind of always like that, so maybe he's always depressed. Uh, I don't know. He, he, I'm gonna get shot. Oh, I'm not gonna get shot. We found the safe spot. Sheesh, sheesh, sheesh. Oh my god. Full health run. Dude, is this our perfect no-hit run? That we've all dreamed of? Oh. I'm learning! Did you know that the human mind has the ability to learn things? <laughs> I'm crap. Ah! No! I know it run! Okay, we gotta shoot this guy in his little toes. We're three lives up! Don't wanna jinx it. 
But we're three lives up, almost full health. We know this part like the back of our hand. Back of our weird pixelated hand. And we just gotta jump over that guy, shoot this guy. All while doing little ring around the rosies. This guy's either gonna hit- let's try and kill him. I don't think we can. Ah, you're a piece of shit. Let's do science. Nah, we can't kill him. It's just not doable. They made an enemy that you just can't kill. And it's RNG if you can dodge him. This is how it goes sometimes. Ooh. Okay, this guy is fucking toxic. Ooh. Ooh. Kinda sick with it. Oh, no, no, please! Oh. See, I almost fell into the pit. That was very scary. We got a double scissor here. Easy. Ring around the rosy. <laughs> A little bit of jump rope. And now we're at Cutman with three lives! It's the run! Wait, do enemies drop any pickups? It seems very rare. Ah, fuck. Okay. I think we're supposed to hug the wall. And then like... Oh, you're a dickhead. Okay. D just don't get hit. Yeah. Okay. Okay, pew 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 pew! Jumped too early, but that's okay. Ah, he jumped. He's a dick. We got free damage on him. Oh, what? He can move all his things coming back. Oh, God. He's so strong. They made him too powerful. Okay. What are you gonna do? Ah, he keeps jumping at us menacingly. Ah, you're such a bastard. No. Ah, okay. Super close. He jumps when you fire? And he's too handsome? It's time for Kung Fu Cut Man! Help! Please! He knows martial arts! Oh god! Please stop! Ah! Oh. He seems to jump whenever he wants! Oh, fuck me. No. There's no Ref way. 2003 Super Shatted $4.99. Ah. The Mega Man game that I can't get past even Dude. one stage. I wish you luck. <laughs> he, uh, does he jump when I jump, maybe? Thanks for the five, Rafi2003. Two, this game is nuts. Ugh. Kung Fu Cut Man! He jumps when you get close. Well, that that completely screws me, because how am I supposed to jump over his, his body if he jumps when I get close? Am I supposed to just, like, run at him with confidence? Oh! Wait! If you run at him with confidence, he jumps right over you! Oh my god! It's almost perfect! Okay. This is the run! Ah, fuck! You really have to... Okay! Okay! Stop! Stop chasing me! You're a dickhead! No, 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 no! Yeah! Let's fucking go! Oh my god! Get fried! The trick is to run at him with confidence! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Gross! What the fuck? Oh my god! What did they do to him? Stop! I mean, that was really pog that we beat it, but what the fuck was that? Okay, so real quick. You guys know if... If I get another game over, it keeps my save file, right? I hit, I hit print screen, so I've got the password just in case I get a game over and I have to re-input it. That would suck. I'm guessing the Lech Man's still weak to him? I think this is all the same. Cutman's weakness is confidence. I got cut in half. Yeah, what the fuck? Oh, hell no. I'm killing myself. In the game. Okay. Is there a continue button? Oh, B button to continue. Oh, you don't have to go back to the stage select. Okay. That's a little different. Well... Looks like we're forced to do- What the fuck? No. 
We're forced to do disappearing block puzzles because there's no rush jet in this one. Oh, that jump sucks! <sighs> oh, no, no, no! That's absolutely diabolical. Holy shit! You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> That's so fucking mean! Ah! And the land- Oh. I thought maybe my foot would get clipped by that. That would be just the icing on the cake. I didn't know we found the Jump King mod for Mega Man. Okay, so we got one, like, pre-jump that we have to make. Okay, nice. Easy. Ease peas. Oh. Please. Okay, nice. Really close. Oh, you've got to be fight. This is so fucking toxic. Okay, a pre-jump left. Then can I make that? Maybe I have to wait, I guess. Beep, 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 beep. Help! Jump! Jump! <laughs> nice reference, Orknestra. He. Okay. Timing's a little weird. Oh, we can just make it. Okay, it's fine. Ah! It's the enemies that were supposed to be in Cutman's level. I guess they're in Electman's level too, aren't they? I don't remember. I don't remember. Mega Man 1's kind of a blur. Even though I played it recently. Ah, shit! Bro, I feel like I can't kill enemies in this game. Should I try Rolling Cutter? Maybe it'll help here? Okay. I got some ammo back, that's... Wait. Oh, the, the weapon's on the left. I thought I like... Wait a minute! You're from Airman Stage! Those are Susie's. Oh. Thank you, I actually didn't know their name. This is like a nostalgic remix of Electman's music? Yeah, it's really good. Like the- I- I actually think the Game Boy music is some of the best. Like I've listened to the- the soundtrack for the second game and it's really, really good. If you listen to the version where the pitch is corrected. Uh, unfortunately, the Game Boy hardware just... It's just not very good at playing music. This, this sounds good, though. It's listenable. Dude, wait. Is this like... Uh, okay... Oh, I can just wait for it to appear over there and then jump on it, I think. Hey, but Sunstar's theme? I haven't heard it. I tried to stay as blind as I could to uh, Mega Man V's soundtrack, just to make sure I get the full value of playing it blind. I've listened to the password select music, because I used that in a video, and I've listened to the intro multiple times, but I haven't played any of the game. So I'm really looking forward to it, because... Ah, fuck you! The game... Ah, shit! Ah, the... It blew me! It blew me too hard! Oh no, we're back here. Well, hopefully... We can make it to Elect Man with zero lives, and... I'm sure he dies to like two or three rolling cutters, and his E doesn't one-shot me. It blew me too hard. What? What? There's nothing. Ah, fuck. There's nothing weird about that. He blew me a little too hard. Yeah, at least this game doesn't have Mega Man 1's no iframes for spikes. True. Gives you a little bit of leeway. Actually, try and make sure I pick those up for my rolling cutter. Ooh. Ooh. 
Okay. Hey, hey. Nice. Overall, this level's really cool. It's the same vibe as uh, the original Lekman level. You know, you just climb and climb and climb past too many obstacles, in my opinion. But uh, um, they've got like these sky elements from Airman stage that fit really well. Cause I mean, no, you're kidding me. Come on, pop out. Oh, you're. That's so mean. That's actually so. Okay, at least they died in one hit. Okay, all right, it's playable. Oh. Mega inch. Got an inch forward to beat the Mets. It's all about the Mets. Love the Mets. Oh. Ah, please. Come on, Susie. Be nice. Damn it. Blood, please. I just want to shoot lemons that deal damage. Well, as soon as I get E, I'm sure this game will really kind of open up. Hopefully they didn't nerf E too hard. Ah, damn it! What the? Oh, please don't kill me anymore. Gotta inch up. Oh. Nice. No shot. There's more Susies. Please. Stop. This shouldn't be too bad, though. Just ba -ba 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 ba 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 Almost got hit by another Susie. Bro, no! The run's over. It's over, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, he did a long jump. Thank God, I'm boost. No, no, no. Tell me there's another one. Is this your boss room? Yeah! Okay, we got... He, he kills us in one hit. He kills us in one hit, boys. That's okay. You just gotta not get hit. Ah, fuck! <laughs> Just don't get hit, forehead. I feel bad for the kid who got this for Christmas or their birthdays. Yeah, what the hell? I mean, they probably had fun. But I mean... Holy crap. Well, you got hit. I sure did. There's... It is what it is. It's just, uh... It's not about how hard you get hit. It's about how hard you get hit and still get back up. I can't defeat a lek man. He's a bastard. He shoots lightning. It does all your damage and health. Oh, God. Ah, fuck. Please. Nice. Someone get the writers of I can't defeat Air Airman on the line. Oh wait, I, I wasn't paying attention. Shit, I was looking at chat. No! Ah! Ah! No, 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 no! Oh, that sucks. <laughs> you guys ever played Jump King? Well. This is what they used to look like. This is him back in middle school. Getting over it, Pogo stuck. I have to play those games eventually too. We're fucked, dude. There's just no. Okay. E. Okay, nice. I refuse to play Jump King out of moral principle. Yeah, it's probably not great for your blood pressure. I need to switch to an actual weapon here. Ah, fuck. Oh, 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 oh. We made it. Not even close. 
these guys, the buster's fine. Should have maybe tried to grab that. This music sounds like the beginning of an RPG. Yeah, it's really, really good. Like someone said earlier, it's just like a a nostalgic remix of a Lechman stage. Whoever made this, whoever made this track and converted it to Game Boy, did a really good job. Okay, okay, okay. I can make that jump easy. I can make this jump easy. What stage is this? And which Mega Man game is it? This is uh, Mega Man 1 Dr. Wily's Revenge for the Game Boy. And this is a Lech Man stage. He. Aw, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, at least we made it. <laughs> this part's so mean. Maybe if I go like... Yeah! Wait, does this just cut through... It might just cut through their shield. I kind of tried to time it with a gamer jump. I'm so dumb. GG! Okay. Ah, damn it. Oh yeah, I know about Team Neko. Oh! I was looking at chat! No! It's back to the airman section! Oh! A gift from the Game of Gods! Thank you, Zeus! You guys kind of look like Zeus. A anyway. We're boosted! This might be the run. Shit! Oh no, don't hit me, please. I'm sorry. Give me another one up, though. Please. Don't look at chat when you're at the laser section. Noted. Yeah. These guys are so fun to look at. I like looking at you guys. Real easy on the eyes. I just look like Airman. Elekman saw his level and got really jealous. And so we installed a bunch of fucking wind turbines and shit into his level. Bastard. Eh. <laughs> Zeus is a patron of the stream! Oh man. I need to play Hades at some point. You guys like Hades? You guys ever play Hades? The... You know, the roguelike? It's a good game. Ooh, you see that? I'm kinda sick with it. Aw, oh, damn it. Want to play Hades one day? You should, I highly recommend it, especially since they're getting a sequel. They're making a sequel. They showed the trailer at the Game Awards. Really, really good looking stuff. Yeah, that game is... Objectively, at least in my... Well, it's hard to say objectively, in my opinion. I think it's just, like... It's hard to find faults with it. Ah, fuck me. Okay, I gotta get up, I got What? I made it last time? Tell me I have to redo the Suzy Q. Can't waste my cut ammo. Please tell me Elekman's actually weak to rolling cutter. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Almost there. We got a big bastard. Aw, oh, you're a dickhead. And another met here, I think. And then we make it. Okay. We're gonna let him kill us once. We're gonna try and dodge all this stuff. Have you heard of Gunman Clive? 
I've never heard of that, no. Can you, can you stop jumping around like a weirdo? Ah! That's weird. Okay. Okay. We're gonna get him. Ah. Okay, we outdamage him. It's easy now. Yeah! Get deeps down, baby. No mechanics needed. Easy. Woo wee! Oh, gross. Again with the side split. Oh! Fade high wind, Eki. Super shatted five dollars. Speaking of Hades 2, did you know there were two character designs cut from the first game for a secondary character named Boffades? What's the name? <laughs> Thanks for the five, Fade High Wind. You almost got me there. The character design cut from the first game for a secondary character named Bofades. Ah, oh, who's Bofades? I'm, that's crazy. I've never heard of him. Why, really? A character named Bofades? Yeah, no E. Wee. It's T now. Yeah, isn't it called uh, Thunder something in the original game? <laughs> But, they give it an E for Lech Man. Both Hades nuts! Ah! 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 He killed me. Okay, I need to take a quick break. I need to get some water. And I need to eat one of these Nutrigrain bars or something. I'll probably play for another hour. I want to go longer. This is really fun. And we'll, we'll... We might beat it in an hour. I don't know. We might go faster. Wait. Be right back. Don't go nowhere. Or I'll cry. Be right back.
All right, we are back. Thank you for waiting. Ready to continue on our rampage? We're absolutely destroying these levels. First try every time. Speed running, dare I say. No hit gamer god challenge. Uh, and we're going to continue in the same vein with uh with Iceman. Oh Philip collects super chatted five dollars. Bastion looks like he ooh. First game by Supergiant slash Hades. Bastion? Bastion? Lucifroggy Boostio oh. super chatted two dollars. Have to look it Your up. Russian accent from the seen. MM4 vid is hilarious. <laughs> Thank you, Lucifroggy. I try. What <laughs> uh I try my best. <laughs> okay. Let's go to Iceman. He might be from Russia himself. Ah! Oh, yeah, I see what you're saying. This is... This remix is really interesting. It's like... I'm kind of vibing while getting absolutely destroyed by these freaking helicopter smile... smiley faces. These... Oh! Oh! Okay, kind of sick. What is this music? It's good! It's like an Iceman remix! Okay, what is that? Is that just an ice block? Is that gonna fall or something crazy like that? I think it's just an ice block. Okay. Whoa, whoa, will they crumble? Oh no. Oh no, we've got mechanics. Okay. Oh, that's cool. I don't think- oh shit. Wow! This game's fucking sick! Wait a minute! They got crumbly ice blocks? Fuck me. Please, just hit! Okay. Ah, oh, please. This is the most I've ever used rolling cutter because I feel like for this game I actually have to. I uh, my buster's so freaking weak. What the hell? Well, what am I supposed to do about that? I gotta shoot it. Are they safe to touch? Okay, I gotta reload the l the level and try to like jump. Aha! Aha! We got puzzles in our Iceman stage. Let's go! Okay, very cool. Oh, more puzzles. Um. Ah! Ah! Okay, I see what. They want you to do there. Okay. Wait, no. Ah! I need to switch back to rolling. Ah, uh, no, we're low on rolling cutter. It's fine. This game is so rad! What the hell? I knew it was like a, a little different from the NES games, but I didn't think they'd have like crazy, crazy new stuff. At least not a ton of it. That's really neat. Thank goodness it's not disappearing blocks again. Bro. Ah. No. Okay. 
Eep. Jump. Slide it to your death there. I sure freaking did. Do you think Fireman level is one of the least original levels here? Okay, we'll see when we get to it. Oh, god damn it. We fail you. Okay, I wait, I I know what I'm supposed to do. Easy. Just uh little j wait, I I already fucked it. Okay, gotta be a little bit quicker on the draw there. Hey, hey, hey. Gotta get into the position. It's kinda weird because you're so slippery. No, ah, okay, that's fine. <laughs> Damn it. Aw oh, man. Do you notice you don't slide on the ice? I didn't notice that, no. Well, that helps, at least. Okay, I'm not supposed to get hit by the icicle, but it worked out. He! Awesome. Ooh. Oh no! You got me f Ah, shit. Please do a- Okay, we're going- we're gonna reset him. Fuck it. <laughs> if I run to the end, I think I can- Yeah, just run it with confidence. Easy. <laughs> Let's go. Ah, shit. Ooh. I definitely planned to dodge his attack. Ah, shit. All according to Keikaku. Ah, shit. Oh, I need that. Die. Please. Ah, shit. Hey. It's like ah oh shit. It's like so weird because it's so hard to like get enough speed to do the jump. E. Okay. Almost there. Is this it? Oh, we have no lives. Well, um. Maybe he dies to, like, one hit. It is E, after all. E. Ah, oh, no. There's, like... <laughs> oh. Oh, it should have been an easy jump. I screwed up. That should have been a really easy jump. Dodge Get fried? Get fried? At least this level isn't that long. Yeah, it's not too bad. When will the stream end? Uh... Probably like 30 minutes. I have been streaming for... Over three hours. And I'd like to stream all day, but I do have some other stuff I gotta do. For those of you that stuck around for this long, thank you. It was really nice hanging out with you. But we're still, we're still going. We're definitely gonna be Iceman's level. And let's see if we can beat Fireman's level after. And then we'll... Fuck me! We'll probably call it a day. Oh, hey, Epic Dude! Been here since the start. Thank you, man. Thank you guys for the support. I hope I was able to entertain you. At the end of the day, that's kind of what the point of this is. I, uh... Normally when I record video games, I just sit alone in my room and uh, I just kind of, I just kind of do it <laughs> and I record it and then I make a video on it. But now that I can stream, I, I plan to just do this. So yeah, anytime you guys are itching for 
some content. Just look at my, the live section on my channel to figure out when the next stream is, and I'll see you there. I can kind of only stream like three days a week right now, I think. But in the future, I'd like to bump that up to four or five. As much as I can, at least, reasonably. Oh. Fade high wind, Eki, super shattered five dollars, <laughs> Mega Man's charge shot be like, Woodlid would leave were 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 blam. That text is feed doodly woodly were 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 Pretty good, honestly. He it do be sounding like that. Do you plan on making videos about other games besides Mega Man? Yeah. In the future. Uh. Definitely be playing other games on the channel besides Mega Man. But I feel like most people here are here for Mega Man. And, I mean, I'm not complaining. As long as they're- Ah, fuck me! No! As long as there are, you know, enough games for me to play, I'll just- I'll just play through them, whatever. If I- if I start getting burnt out of Mega Man, then I'll- I'll switch to something else. And if you guys start getting burnt out of Mega Man, let me know in the comments and I'll- I'll try something different. But, uh... Yeah. Oh, thank you, Thedrick Binks. It's nice knowing people are here for... for me. It's... <laughs> you are dead at the end. Yeah, I'm... I'm looking a little fucked up. But maybe... We'll get a clutch one-up drop and we'll be on our way. Ah, oh, fuck me. Please. No. Yeah, I plan to play a lot of those obscure games that I put. Those are kind of like comfort picks for me. Like if, if you're feeling burnt out of a certain game, maybe you're like an MMO player or you're like a professional leaguer, or maybe you're trying to get into streaming, but you're sticking to one game. Just try to remember those games of your past that, uh... That you remember fondly and just give them a shot. It doesn't have to be on stream, you just... Because burnout is very real and it's something you have to... You have to think about. Fuck! Okay, it's fine. Has anyone ever... <laughs> have you ever heard a streamer say, Hey, it's kinda hard to play video games and talk at the same time. Well, they were right! They're a little right. Um... Yeah, like I was saying, if you're feeling burnt out of any particular thing... You... You should really allow yourself to just play, like, a game that comforts you. Um... That's my advice, and it's probably advice you've heard before. But it's surprising how much fun you can have just playing a, a really old game from your childhood. At least that's how I feel. This whole journey has been really fun because, I mean... Honestly, before I made that first video, I hadn't played... Damn it! Ah, I'm choking! It's the final stretch and I'm choking! Um, honestly, before I started this channel, I hadn't played the Mega Man games in a long time. I think recently I had gotten into, uh... I bought the ZX collection, I was playing some of that, and I was like, huh. Adversa I haven't played the Super Shattered five dollars. Why is it raining battle chips in Brazil? Why is it raining battle chips in Brazil? I think you might be thinking of Bakugan. That's the that's the anime where it rains 
<laughs> where it rains battle items. <laughs> is it weird for me that my comfort game is a halfway decent Hot Wheels game for the Xbox 360? Hot Wheels beat that? That's not weird at all. You're completely valid. In fact, I kind of want to play Hot Wheels beat that. I've never played it, but knowing it's something that someone legitimately enjoys is like, oh, cool. Maybe I should try it. That's one of the reasons I like obscure games so much is because, like, it's nice talking about Mega Man to you guys in video form because a lot of people can relate. Like, yeah, I played Mega Man as a kid. I get that. I couldn't defeat Airman either. And, um, but when it comes to obscure games, the viewer can just kind of sit there and let their imagination run wild. It's like, Silhouette Mirage, I've never heard of that, but you sound really, really excited about it, so... Holy crap, I'm, I'm immersed, I'm super immersed right now. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah. So, I'm so screwed here. Okay, it's fine. Ah! If we can just get to Iceman. Need a better weapon. Aha. Ah, oh, shit, I was looking at chat. It blends in. Okay. You can be the cool dude at the gamer party. That's right. Yeah. I'm kind of a hipster. I played Tomba 2 before it was cool. See, this is how the- ah, fuck. Oh, it actually hits kind of hard, though. Okay. L. <laughs> the. Yeah, Tomba 2, baby! We talked about Tomba a little earlier when I was talking about obscure games. <laughs> That's one of my comfort games. Let's go! Look at me moonwalking! Hee <laughs> hee! Oh! <laughs> oh god, more more analog horror. Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. What did they do to my boy? <laughs> oh. Nova Blast 4455 plays Super Shattered $20. Ayo caught a power guy stream. Sweet. Yo, thanks for the 20 Super Chat. My boy, Nova Blast 445. Thank you so much. Yeah, you found me. This is my first stream. Oh. Music cut out. This is my first stream and we're probably going to be doing more. We're going we're gonna to stream again tomorrow and the day after. But uh, I can only stream three days a week. So that's how we're doing it. Until further noticed. You know, I think of the first game, Fireman's... Theme, the way it plays through the NES is my least favorite. It's because the the like drum line in the back is very harsh sounding on the NES. It's like and I killed myself on purpose here to reset my lives. <laughs> Smile. I, I'm, I'm not bad. At, I'm not bad at video games. Um, but this sounds really good. Oh, oh, like give it a listen. It's a lot softer on the ears. Like, if you go back and listen to the NES version, it's very rough. You got the doggo, I did! This is my boy Murph! He's a sweet little boy. Okay, we need to switch to E! I'm tired of these fools living in this world rent-free when I have an E in my pocket. Ah, shit. Oh. That's tough. Oh okay, yeah, it's not too bad, actually. E. <laughs> Can I freeze these just like the other game? Do I have to? I feel like I don't have to. Your shield is no match for- Oh, it is a match for E. But no match for two E's. Oh! 
Cypher Skies Super Chatted $2. Start with Bounce Man when you do Mega Man 11. Thank you, Cypher Skies. For the two. Want me to start with Bounce Man? I can't remember who I actually started with when I played Mega Man 11 back when it first came out. Ah, man. Uh. Oh, we're at the start. That sucks. That's fine. I have the power within me. Within me. A rolling cutter actually kills those faster. Oh wait, we're not at the start. It just looks similar to the start. Nice. Nice. You have a headache yet? Uh, no, I'm doing good. <laughs> Thank you for asking though. I'm chillin'. I'm doing okay. I can make it another 20 minutes. Thank you. Oh! Nova Blast 4455 plays Super Shattered $10. Honestly, I like the harshness of the NES soundtrack. Thank you for the 10. Wow. Uh. Yeah, I mean. That's a, that's a f fair evaluation. There are times when I listen... I, it's just like Fireman's stage in particular that I don't like so much. But I I do listen to it sometimes, it just, sometimes it gets to be a little too much. Uh, overall, I like his theme, I just don't like the way the NES plays it. But I do listen to it, because I do like it overall, but, uh... You like the Powered Up version of Fireman's theme? I'm... I'm not familiar with the Powered Up versions. Ah, fuck. There's not like a peek your head out thing for this part. I don't know it off the top of my head. Uh, I bet I'd like it, though. If it sounds similar to this, but just, like, less, uh... Let's ah! I got debated. Danny Cookie oh. Super Chatted five dollars. I think they're both good, but Rush Jet One combining the two themes in his MM1 remade album was aces. Oh, thank you for the five, Danny Cookie. I haven't heard that remix, but I'll have to go give it a look. See. Rushjet 1. Oh, Rushjet 1. Wait, yeah, I... Is that who I'm... My memory's kind of foggy. But... They, they make remixes and stuff. Of course they do. Uh, Nova but... Blast 4455 oh. plays Super Shattered Nova $10. Blast? Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. You're going absolutely crazy with the Super Chats. I really appreciate it, man. Oh my god. Nova Blast is giving me the strength to beat every video game. Oh! I should have refilled my E. Oh god. Freaking smiley face helicopters. There is a bot in my chat. What the hell? Get out of here! Wait. I can't ban them through Discord. Ree! Get out of here! It's funny how they. <laughs> the bot had the name Mega in their name. Kind of weirdly. Weird coincidence. Oh, that's mean. I wonder if I can freeze any portion of that. Probably not, right? Oh! Wait a minute! My gamer's intuition was correct! Hmm. I wonder if I can freeze this trap using Ice Slasher. It's worth a try. Ah! <laughs> that's a... Uh, that's sort of an instant replay of what went on in my head. As I did that. I'm gonna die! Please stop throwing fire at me! 
Ah, damn it! The boss is right there, isn't it? Ah! 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 Hmm. Ah. Uh. Oh! Super Waluigi Super Shatted $15. I started watching your videos recently and I absolutely love the content you make. Keep up the good work. Thank you so much, Super Waluigi. That's so kind of you. Aw, thanks a bunch, man. I'm happy. I know I say this a lot in the comments when I reply to them. I'm just I'm just happy people managed to find my channel. I don't know how the YouTube algorithm works or you know what kind of magic secrets it holds. I just There's like I worked very hard on my videos, so I I take pride in that, but there is a little bit of luck involved, I'm sure. So, I'm very thankful that people managed to find my videos in the first place. So thank you so much, and thank you so much for the support, and thank you guys, everybody that's been super chatting and joining the Mega Chads, and even if you haven't done that, thank you for just watching, because, I mean, if you can't afford it or maybe you don't want to donate money that that's fine I, I I don't expect anyone to do that of course but um you know just watching the stream is an amazing way to help the channel just just by watching and if you if you had fun at the stream I think you can like streams if you scroll down right now click the like button that that'd be really cool I I like I said I don't really understand the YouTube algorithm but I bet it helps for streams. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much. You are really poggers, every last one of you. I'm gonna try not to die to this torch guy, not to be confused with torch man. Um, we're gonna see if we can freaking beat Fireman and see what the next half of this game looks like. Without... I gotta get to him without dying. And it seems like these guys are pretty tanky. I'm all out of power. Oh, come on, please don't kill me. Whoa, wait. I can get some E power? Inch forward just a little bit. No, fuck me! Ah! Why did I do that? Why did I just keep walking? Why did I just have some confidence for once? Ah! Bean. Super shutted one dollar and ninety nine cents. Thanks for being such an amazing and funny creator. Thank you so much, K Bean. That means a lot. You guys are the reason I keep going. All the support, all the nice comments in my feed. So your stream will be two million years long. Yeah, it might take us a while to get. To fireman and beat him. Oh. YouTube honestly recommended my video when I only had like 13 subs. Wow. Yeah, I mean, sometimes I get YouTube recommended from like very new channels. It's just like a wonder that people clicked on him. I, I guess it's partly to the credit that I put Gutsman's thick ass on the first thumbnail. Maybe that's what got people to look. And then Airman and Mega Man and I'm, I'm fucked. I'm so fucked. This second half is so long and it's so hard. It's so hard and long. Don't clip that. Help! Okay. Oh! Random boy on YouTube super shattered two dollars. Pee pee. <laughs> Thanks for the two bucks, man. Nice pee pee. Okay. So, no, hey! Do not clip that part. Okay? You're not allowed to clip that. Come on, guys, I'm at the end of my rope here. 
I'm trying to- Fuck! I ran right into it! I'm trying to beat fire, man! So we can- So we can see what the next ro- I don't even- Are there four more Robot Masters? I think so, right? Oh! This might be our ticket! To beating Fireman! E! Oh, a single E is enough to kill that. E! Wait, I didn't kill him that time. What the fuck? Why is it so inconsistent? Zip super chatted two dollars. Poo poo. Poo poo. Thank you for the two, Zip. Please don't kill me. I'm so sorry for everything I've done. Well, there's no way in hell I beat this dude. No hit. There's like a strat for beating him in NES where you like chase him around and you don't shoot him until. I don't know this strat. I've only ever just. Okay, no. Ah! The strat won't work, I think. Wait. Please don't do anything else. As long as you just do this. Yes! Let's go! Let's freaking go! Oh my god! First try, 1 HP, get clapped, you idiot! Fireman, more like Dyer Man. Yeah, baby, let's go. Oh my God, Goose the Master, welcome to the Mega Chads, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> We're the best gamer. We're the strongest gamer in history. Oh, wait a minute. It's just Wily, right away. Okay, I'm gonna, uh, oh. oh. I'm gonna try and match my eyebrows up with him. <laughs> oh wow, that looks really cool. I like the little silhouette around him. That's a lot of free stuff that I'm not a, did I miss something? I totally missed something, didn't I? What? Okay, now use carry. I don't have carry! Where did I miss carry? Guys, help! <laughs> you got I got carry from- Oh, I did get carry from Fireman! Ah, oh, that's on reading comprehension, thank you! Okay, let's see what it- Do it! Carry me! Wait, what am I doing wrong? Is that just it? Or does it... Eh? What? Oh, jump and use it. Okay. Ah! Oh, it really is a carry! <laughs> I feel so boosted right now! Oh, man. Iron Boy Super Chatted 38 cents. Oh hey, GE finally got a dog. Hurry. Oh, thank you so much for the super, Iron Boy. Yeah, I got a dog. His name is Murph. Okay, so Firestorm is okay, I'll I'll give that a try first. Let's see. Oh! Oh, I see. It's got the little shield around it like before. Please die. Okay, well. I mean, I still can't kill those things. But surely they... Huh. Okay, yeah, that is really strong. I'm gonna die, though. Uh... Well, it's probably all for the best because I do have to get a game over at some point. Ah! I'm gonna... Dude, also? Listen to this music. That's... that's really good. I like that a lot. That's super catchy. <laughs> Holy crap.
Is it true? Is Mega Man Game Boy music the best genre of music in the world? <laughs> or in Mega Man at least? Okay, he's still pretty good against the this drill hallway. Ah, uh, well. They seem to This is really mean actually. They just spawn right in front of you and they come out so fast. It's not like the other game. Ah, oh, I should have tried to get more carry energy. Oh, wait, I'm in the death pit! Now I'm gonna get zapped! Ah. Well. That's how it is. That's just the way it is, gamers. Oh. If you played the time attack stages in Mega Man 10, this stage should feel familiar. Oh yeah, I actually have it. Pluto and Saturn stage themes are... Yeah, I, I bet they are. I, I haven't... I haven't played Mega Man 5 for the Game Boy yet, Mega Man V, but... I'm really looking forward to it, and I purposely made myself blind to the soundtrack of that game just so I can hear it. Uh during my first playthrough. Okay. So, uh, we've been streaming for like four hours. Thank you guys for everybody that came. I gotta write down my little password here so we can jump back into it tomorrow and probably finish this game up. So yeah, um... If you enjoyed the stream... Thank you. Uh... Thank you for coming to the my first ever stream. Uh, none of this ever would have been possible without your guys' support. All the likes and comments and subs. Thank you so much for the for all the memberships and super chats during the stream. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the stream, I'll be streaming again tomorrow at the same time. I'll put a schedule. Uh, I'll, I'll schedule it right after this stream so you can see. Iron Boy Super Chatted 38 oh. cents. Love your channel. Happy I found it. Thank you, I am Boy. I'm happy you found it too. One last thing before I go. Uh, I did make a community post to vote on our 10k subscriber special. I'm going to put a link to it in chat just so you guys don't miss it. But of course, you can just find it on my channel. I'm, I'm going to pin it. Eh. Now I'm gonna pin it here. Make sure you guys go check it out. Make sure you vote on what you want to see. So far, the Mega Man X4 fan dub is winning. <laughs> uh, yeah. I. That makes sense, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys so much. Thank you all the super chats and subs. I'll make sure to buy Murph some good treats. For that he really deserves it for being such a good brave boy for the whole stream look at him you want me to put him back on the bed oh close this put him back on your bed so we can take a nap come on murph come on little murph get back in the bed yeah there he is <laughs> Say goodbye to the stream, Murph. So yeah, once again, thank you guys so much for coming. Uh, we're streaming again tomorrow. And... Uh, yeah, probably more Mega Man Game Boy stuff. Thank you guys again. Uh, I don't know how to do a stream outro. But uh, yeah, thank you guys a bunch for watching. I'll see you again tomorrow. Uh, you guys are awesome. Keep being gamers to the fullest extent of your power and uh yeah i'll see you all again tomorrow bye